Hey, 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 hey. Said loot crazy. You can find like a crowbar, run like a leopard, but you never be better than Commander Shepherd. I think my motherfucking, um, I think the fucking ping bot's broken again. Mom, the ping bot's broken again. It's not paying the fact that I'm live. Let's do that. Why do that? I didn't That's so weird. Look, it works sometimes. Hey, thanks for the follow. Fragilities. Ooh, that's a, oh, that's a really good name. What the heck? Hey, thanks. Thanks for the follow. How are you? Who, 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 who. <laughs> How are you? Who are you? Where are you from? How? How do you find me? <laughs> uh, uh, before I start the game, maybe maybe you can just chat to and chat a little bit in a second. Oh, now it now now it now it pings that I'm going live. Thank you, ping bot. Very cool. Love you. Mwah, 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 mwah. <laughs> can you guys even hear me on the the song? I hope I hope it's not too bad. Not, I hope it's not too disruptive. All right, give me a second. I've actually had a pretty, pretty, pretty good day. Pretty good day. Pretty good day. So let's chill and chat for a little bit before we start the game, eh? Eh? It got a... In my hand. Where my hands? Where my, where my face? Where's my face? You gotta interact with the viewers, is what they say. I think I just want to make friends. I'm having a reverse parasocial relationship. I'm admitting it right now. Give me a second. Maybe I should start with the game first. Just in case. Like, so we can just immediately transition to it. You don't, you don't need to wait for me to start up. Video games. I love video games. I love ones that don't make me angry. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, by the way, Fragilities. How are you? How are you? I know it's a bit weird. The starting screen. Nobody talks over the starting screen. Oi. <laughs> what kind of accent is that? <laughs> there we go. Whoa. Yo, I like this. All right, there we go. Whoa. I'll just have the game in the background so I can just like transition to it immediately. Resume, and then um, before I actually start the stream, I shall, I shall, I shall auto battle on my phone game. It's great. Wait, how long have I been on the standby screen? It's like six minutes. Uh oh, that's 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 no good. Even though like the the big name streamers have their standby screen for like 10, 20 minutes, and I actually just go to bed before they actually start the stream. Jesus. Okay. And here we go. Hello, hello. Wait. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. You have chosen or been chosen to tune into the stream. Whether you're here to stay or on your way to parts unknown. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. It's safer here. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Hello. 
good morning good evening good afternoon wherever you are thank you for tuning in thank you thank you oh no i'm angry no hmm? i'm trying i'm trying to smile but i throw my brow and it's like you're angry no i'm not angry <laughs> oh thanks for tuning in guys wait no that sounds like i'm closing out no i'm not hello welcome welcome how's everybody's day how's everybody's day thank you for coming ash Thanks for tuning in. Wait, God. Hello, Ash. Hello, Snaggy. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Yo, day's good? Yo. Same. <laughs> I know, I know it's really like the meme answer like a few, a year or two ago. It's like, same. True. I know that for you. No, but really, I had a really good day today too. I watched an ad for Apex uh, Cross Monster collab before the stream. Wait, what? I want it. I didn't have it. I don't think so. Uh, I think it'll probably take a while for him to roll out over here. I hope. I hope it'll, it'll, it'll eventually roll out here. So that's cool. That's cool. I'm actually I'm actually one step closer to being sponsored by um, Monster Energy. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Maybe it's because I keep saying Monster Energy on stream, and it's like. It, it auto detects me saying it that's why they have alexa they want speech recognition technologies so they're like oh this 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 guy said this word he said this word okay put all the put all the ads put all the ads that he said the word for on his stream right it makes sense huh am i having a tin full of hat moment i don't think so I don't think so at all. No, uh, uh. But, boop, boop. I'm big brain. You may not realize I have a really big brain. You know, I've been I've been called a kid genius when I was younger. Look at where I am. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. No, no, none of that bit. That bit is a little bit too personal. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Um, today, today I had a really good day, I had a really good day, and I'm really happy, cause, cause like, cause like, I got recognized by a, by a company, a company I've never talked with, oh my god, what am I doing the accent, kid genius curse is the worst, true, I, I, I hate it, somebody please go back in time and tell the person telling me I'm a genius to stop, Inflating my ego. And then need that, that shit. Cause look at me now. Nah, but I'm happy. So maybe 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 our 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 hidden genius. Our hidden like smartness, what do you call it? A genius is in our ability to realize that happiness lies within. I don't know. I was going for something out there. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. I, 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 fuck. This, this is gonna be so bad on like YouTube, but cause just export these things direct. I can't be fucked to edit them any, um, at all. I should, but yeah. <laughs> um, I had I had a really good day. Um, like I had a pretty bad day initially. I had a pretty bad um, morning, I had a pretty bad Monday, but uh, and Saturday and Sunday, but but things turned around. Things turned around. Bad, bad, bad things are temporary, but 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 you you will outlast bad, the bad thing. Just keep that in mind. Yeah. It's so weird because, like. So basically to give some context is that I ordered a VR sensor on Monday, which was a public holiday. So technically they shouldn't be in office, right? And they shouldn't be processing the order at all. So it doesn't count as a working day. I can't go down to the place to collect the thing I bought. So I paid for like um, local shipping, which was actually pretty expensive. 
uh, they said, oh, uh, on, on the thing, it said, like, oh, it'll take two to four working days. I'm, like, counting the days, like, okay, so the, the, the VR chat stream will be on Saturday. That'll be, that'll be just four days. So maybe, maybe, maybe it'll make it, make it in time. And they got back to me just today in one working day. And they're, like, so it's ready to send? I'm, like, oh, really? And um, I got my sensor. I got my new VR sensor. I can't wait to test it out. Um, I can't wait to set it up. And hope everything works. I have to hope everything works because um, I'm replacing one. I know the other thing, the other one's probably working. Probably working, you know? There's a probability that that one might be broken as well. Um, yeah, so yeah. It came to me in, on, in one working day, despite them saying two to four. And um, they actually messaged me directly. They're like, oh, um, it's ready to send. Uh, what time would you like to receive? I'm like, oh, we'll receive in the evening because I got work and stuff. And he, and and, 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 and sure, like I went out, I went to do my work. I, I went to do like work things. And then when I got home, I, I you know, I, I, I messaged them. I was like, okay, uh, I took a, a photo. And then uh, I, I messaged them like, oh, thank you. Thank you for uh, sending it so quickly. Uh, I've received the, the, the product. I've received my purchase. And they're like, oh, uh, no problem. Uh, get some back and forth. I'm like, oh, uh, so if I, I want to, um, you know, RMA it or, you know, the warranty, who I contact. They're like, oh, you can contact these, uh, the, uh, the, the, the company, the, this company. Instead of just directing to us, you have to submit a ticket. They're like, okay, sure. There's a, there's a process. Cool. And they, and I'm like, thank you very much. And they're like, hey, you, we actually know you. We call you VR man in the office. I'm like, who the fuck? <laughs> How? Who? Huh? But well, it was great. It was great. It was actually really great. I got recognized. I don't even know. I don't even know these people and they know me. I live in their head rent free. And not like a bad impression, right? It's like a good impression. It's really nice. That really, that really made my day, honestly. That really, really made my day. I'm really happy. And it's, it's just the little things. Maybe, maybe because they know I'm VR man, they they gave me preferential treatment, which was kind of, which was kind of, which was kind of bad, I think. I, I wanna I wanna be treated normally. I don't wanna be like, oh, it's this dude. We have to hurry up. We have to give him ex uh, excellent service. I want to experience the normal service so I can review your your company more properly. But maybe I'll buy under a different name next. Hmm. Undercover. Um. Oh, we got found out real fast. Yeah, right. I I don't know. Maybe because I I used to post a lot about VR stuff on on Facebook. I post it on Twitter. Right. I still post it on Twitter. I don't post it on Facebook anymore. But maybe because of me posting on Facebook, um, I kind of uh, got circulated a little bit. So maybe I should I should post more on Facebook. Don't know. Maybe I'll make a Facebook page. I won't. Time to change your alias to VR man. God. Hey, welcome to the stream. No, welcome to the stream, Vivi. Welcome to the stream, Nyanfi. How are you? 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 Days. But yeah, I got found out my secret, my secret identity has been exposed as we are, man. This is bad. This is very bad. <laughs> what kind of accent is that? Scottish? I don't know. I just, I just like um, imitating accents because it's, it's really cute and really fun. I like, I like accents. Um, yeah, just that little simple thing. Uh, I can't wait to test it. Uh, because of the VR stream on Saturday. Please come. It'll be really cool because I'm showing off Virtual Market. The now rec re now now recognized by Guinness World Records, the biggest virtual event. Hey. So yeah. I wanted to work at the <clears throat> at Virtual Market before, but they they're looking for more volunteers and employees, so I was like, man, uh. <laughs> uh so yeah. That's my day. That was my day. I hope everybody's day has been going all right. If not, hang in there. You know? 
Um, what, what, what did it say? Bad times don't last, but good people do. Ooh. I'm kind of on a high, so I'm probably biased. I'm very much biased right now. But yeah, hang in there, guys. Hey, big love. Do the big love. Thank you so much for 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 coming for coming to my stream. It means means the means the world to me because I have a reverse parasocial relationship issue. <laughs> Anybody and everybody who pops into my chat, right? I'll be like, Oh my god, it's the person. The game. Oh yeah, it's really nice. I'm really happy. <laughs> okay. Maybe I should start the game now, eh? Yeah, let me see. Okay. Let's get to the actual content y'all tuned in for. Or or maybe tune in for me, little old me. It's nice. Thank you very much. <laughs> One of these days, somebody's gonna write in chat like, I don't care what you pay. I just came here for you. I'm like, oh, blush emoji. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, Ash, how's the... How's the, um, the, the thing, the, the, the proce not the procedural, procedural animation thing, the gravity ball thing, is it, is it finished yet? Oh, I really would like to see it, that would be really cool, because you didn't see 4D. <laughs> Submit it already? Okay, okay, alright, alright, okay. It's on your Facebook? Yeah, but uh, I was hoping to see the entire thing, like, um, like the completed sequence. I wonder if the guy's done with it, or is he gonna upload it to his YouTube? Okay. YouTube. I should, I should make some YouTube content. I should make, um, meme videos to put on Twitter. Not yet, I think the end of the month. Okay. Get the, the game. Where's the game? Will it load the game? Oh, it does. Okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm not addicted to Final Fantasy. It's okay. I don't know. <laughs> oh, my God. That's loud. Okay. Dude, I want a view like this above my bed. That'd be so cool. Oh, wait. Did the music cut out? Oh, the audio's so weird. Okay. Don't look up. So. Previously. Previously a Mass Effect 2. Um, we recruited the very model of a Salarian scientist, Morden Solos. And now... Since we're on the same planet, anyway, we're gonna go and investigate this this funny little fella that decided to name himself Archangel. This little this little chuny bio of a, of a of a little vigilante, you know. There's this guy who decided to start killing random criminals and sniping them in the head, and call himself. Archangel. Who the hell calls himself Archangel? Oh shit! I gotta actually, I gotta actually park our our, our ship back on the on the fucking planet. Who? I think that's that's such a silly vigilante name. Archangel. Who? Oh, dude, the animation's so fast because I'm because because I load really quick. Um, I'm the very model of the scientist. Scientist Hilarion. I bring Morden. I like him, just because I like him. M more than these two, unfortunately. I don't really like Zaid, but uh, I'll bring him along for the firepower. So, 
Well, I, I will pick a better uh, vigilante name. I mean, Arch Archangel is kind of lame. Maybe I maybe I'll go for for SF Tengu. <laughs> I go I go sinful Tengu. That's the that's the actual fall of SF. Okay. Um. I'll up disruptor ammo because I actually need that. Um, accelerate. So they're in scientists. Combat skills, weapon damage, health and shields. He doesn't need weapon damage. He needs just like skill, skill damage. He just needs to skill my heart. Eh, it's okay. I'm about Zaid. Okay, I don't need to pop any points into him. I'm not talking Mantis. We're gonna Carnifex. Okay, we're good. Uh, okay. Judging by the quarantine reports, the plague has been completely eradicated, Shepard. Dr. Solis's assistant has been helping any patients with complications. Excellent. Knew he could do it. I have also accessed oh, nice. messages between mercenary groups regarding plans to deal with the Archangel. There's a recruiting station at Afterlife that may have information on him. Whoa, Dead Space looks great here. Come on, let me in. Come on, let me in. Arya's expecting me. Ugh. Arya's expecting me. <laughs> he said it. That guy, that guy, man. That guy. Yeah, I like Dead Space. Or the space is dead. I should play Dead Space on stream, but I'm really bad at horror games. Maybe for October. Ooh. Yes. Brandy. I should I should get a bottle of brandy. Celebrate something soon. All right. What do you need? I need Archangel. I'm trying to track down Archangel. You and half of Omega. You want him dead too? Half of Omega? Why is everyone after him? He thinks he's fighting on the side of good. There is no good side to Omega. Everything he does pisses someone off. It's catching up to him. Okay, so people are trying to kill him. Just the kind of guy I'm looking for. Really? Well, aren't you interesting? You're going to make some enemies teaming up with Archangel. That's assuming you can get to him. He's in a bit of trouble right now. Oh, okay. Aside from trouble, his really bad naming sense. Join forces to take him down. They've got him cornered, but it sounds like they're having trouble finishing him off. They've started hiring anybody with a gun to help. Could be opportunity to get close. Need guns. Wait, no, have guns. Excellent. They're using <laughs> Morden. Come on. Just over there. Have guns. Sure Excellent. Them. I fucking love Morden. He's such a fucking character. Well, maybe I should just go with like Morden and. Uh, maybe I should bring Morden to for most of my missions now. Unless it's something specific. I appreciate the help. See if you still feel that way when the Mercs realize you're here to help him. Sounds like I don't have much time to waste. You've got all the time in the world. Archangel? Not so much. She looks so weird lying down like that. Maybe they just kind of like stood it, st took her like standing animation and rotated her like 45 degrees. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. It's all about the composition about these games. Still sad till this game what happened to Morton in ME3. Yeah, but it's cool though. Like, it's cool. Okay, he gets he gets his redemption arc. I hear you're recruiting. Mm. Why don't you step inside? You'll get paid when the job's done, just like everyone else. Who's next? Damn. They pay you on the day, on the job? Cool. Oh, aren't you sweet? You're in the wrong place, honey. Stripper's quarters are that way. Fuck you. Wait, I don't get punch him? I bet mine's bigger. Impressive. So, you're here to fight them. Sure, if this is the place to go after Archangel. This is the place. Standard fee is 500 credits each. You get paid when the job's done. If you die, your friends don't collect your share. You'll need your own weapons and armor. Looks like you got that covered. 500 no, bucks? This does not make you a member of the Blue Suns, Eclipse, or the Blood Pack. You are a freelancer, period. Any questions? Freelancers are cool. 
Um, I'm not gonna bother. Just gonna go. find my. Just head over to the transport depot outside the club. One of our boys will take you from there. Send in the next one. Oh, is this fucking punk? Hey, is this where I sign up? You look a little young to be freelancing as a merc. I'm old enough. I grew up on Omega. I know how to use a gun. Yeah, you know enough to get yourself killed. Nice. I can handle myself. Besides, I just spent 50 credits on this pistol, and I want to use it. Get your money back. Hey, what are you... Trust me, kid. You'll thank me later. Oh, I want to be, I want to be 50 cent. I want the black, black should be shooty. Yeah, fuck these kids. Fuck these kids. <laughs> Bro. I bought, I bought new black, black with my parents' money. And I think I can take on the world. Our fantasies, man. Who the heck is this guy? What are you looking at? <gasps> Wait, is he? Who is he? Why, why can I talk to this guy? Okay. Don't you have something better to do than pick fights with people you don't know? No, just the ones who get in my face. You see my gun. Do you really want to do this? I. Fine. You're off the hook. For now. Who's this guy? Around. Oh, okay. Cool. Okay, that's three Paragon points. <laughs> maybe he's like a. Maybe he's like a side quest character from ME1. Come on, let me in. Why are you expecting me? Ugh. Are you expecting me? Ugh. I love that. So, I heard a human went into the plague zone. Then I found out about a lot of dead vorture down there. You know anything about this? Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, unknown. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. How's your day? How's your day? You're doing well? The plague zone. We're going to, uh... Hmm. Dead vorture? No. Don't know anything about that. Uh-huh. Right. Well, my job just got a whole lot easier. I'll just be going. Keep up the good work. Oh, this is Captain Gavorn. This is the this is the person the Vortra. While I've been standing here. What? This is the guy who's like against the Vortras. Oh wait, no, he's using the Vortras, I think. I don't know. How are you gonna know? How are you how are you? How is season ten? For you, I'm loving season ten. I'm on the mission. I hope you're ready. Archangel's been annihilating you freelancers. Whatever. Ready when you are. Get in. Annihilate these nuts. Got them. <laughs> okay, Morden and Zaid. HP has contributed a total of 4,000 points. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, HP. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. How's the game jam? How's the game jam? Oh, man. I want a floating car like that. That's really cool. It's about time they sent me someone who looks like they can actually fight. Crunching work instead? Good, 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 good. Cool, 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 cool. The recruiter was a little vague. We wouldn't get many hires if everyone knew the truth. Archangels hold up True. a building at the end of the boulevard over there. It's just like He's every single recruiter. Position, and the only way in is over a very exposed bridge. It's a killing ground. But he's getting tired, making mistakes. We'll have him soon enough. Yeah, focus on your work. Don't... Don't, um... Procrastinate on work. I kind of want to talk, but yeah. You guys have a plan? A small team is waiting to infiltrate his hideout, but we need to draw Archangel's fire so they can move in. And that's where we come in. Exactly. You'll be on a distraction team. Head straight over the bridge and keep Archangel busy so the infiltration team can sneak in behind him. That's got to have suicide. Pretty much. But you look like you can handle it. Head up to the boulevard and get to the third barricade. Talk to Sergeant Katka. He'll tell you when to go in. Dude, we're all about suicide missions. It's okay. We're certified. We're Asha certified for suicide missions. Let's go. I better go find Sergeant Katka. Good idea. Watch yourself on the boulevard. Archangels killed dozens out there already. Good. 
In's gonna be easy. Out's gonna be a bitch. <laughs> Thank you, Zaid. Let's find him first. Then we'll figure out how to get back. Zaid's got a fucking mouth of him, but I like him. He's he swears like a fucking pirate. Like a sailor. He sounds more like a fucking sailor than um than like a soldier, right? Oh, he's stuck, he's stuck. Look at him. Uh -huh. Your pathfinder can't beat this. Can't beat a car. Oh, oh, okay. Space sailors. Guess we're going with the Mercs. The heavy mechs and gunship possess considerable firepower. Weakening them before leaving will improve your chances. Thank you, Edie. Space sailors. I mean, think about it. Every single person in space would be a sailor, wouldn't they? Wouldn't they? They would need to know, like, a degree of, um, naval warfare to do space warfare. Can I see him from there? Oh, look at him. No, it's probably very hard to see. It's a little blue thing over there. Who could that be? I who that is, huh? Archangel. Bruh. Hello. As the first wave goes in, the infiltration team will attempt to take Archangel by surprise. Okay. Do you need something? Who are you? You lead the Eclipse? You figure that out by yourself? I'm Jared. I run Omega's Eclipse. What do you need, freelancer? The plan of attack. The infiltration team is the main focus of the attack. Tarek's plan, not mine. He doesn't want to lose any more men, so he's throwing you freelancers at the problem. Archangel's not going anywhere, so I suppose there's no harm in trying. Who knows? Maybe you'll get lucky. Uh, <laughs> cards. So you're just gonna hide here while the freelancers get killed? Precisely. You're paid to be a distraction, nothing more. Whether you survive or not is up to you. Oi. Hey. I'll get going. Good idea. I think uh, I think I've been known to survive. I've survived the, you know, being spaced, being blown up. I think I'm good. I've got a bit of experience in that. Tark, I've spoken to Garm, and he and his men are on board. Assuming this operation is successful, you can count on higher morale and extensive buy-in from the men. From the losses we've already taken, possibly exists that we won't have the men need to continue on the next on to the next objective. It's clear though that none of our organization would be ready to move on Aria without the existence of the other two. <gasps> Whoa! Oh, it took the damn head. Nice. Nobody saw that, right? Yeah, nobody saw that. Nobody saw like me take an entire data pad. So they're applying to to turn on Arya. Oh. Yo, this shit looking like Detroit become human. Hello. I'm gonna take one home. I can hack this for what? Oh shit, how do I do hacking? Ah, uh, hacking! Oh shit. Um. This? Uh. I think old age is kind of fucked over my attention span. I don't, can't even recognize half of these. Ah, uh, there we go. Cool. Money. Bypass friend or foe. ID. Oh, what? I can turn it. I can use it against the peop uh, the enemies? Cool. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, pattern recognition. Surely, surely that hasn't shot up by old age. Yeah. Okay. Targeting parameters reconfigured. That should slow them down. Nice. Anyone who activates that thing will get blown the hell up. Friend or foe. Thank you, Zaid. Uh, fuck off. Oh. Jesus. What's in here then? The blood pack? Yeah. You're in the wrong place, freelancer. You the blood pack leader? Name's Garm. That's all you need to know. 
I'm stuck here waiting till you freelancers are done. This is just like war. hit anime, Borderlicious Space Pirates. What's, what's that? What's that anime? I know Space Dandy. That's a, that's about space and big, big, big tatas. What's Borderlicious Space Pirates? Ooh. I'm gonna get shot out, aren't I? I'm just gonna hack. I'm just gonna hack in the open right now. No. Uh -oh. Can I actually? Oh, okay. <gasps> no, that took away one. Uh, uh, okay, there we go. But this face is double the tatas. Ooh. I know what I'm watching. Do I miss using an assault rifle? I miss playing soldier because I want to use an assault rifle. What's in here? Ooh, goodies. Ooh. We can use this. We can use this. Yeah, just shout in the storeroom. They know I'm looting their stores. Utility. Okay. Utility. Hold on. I'm looking for Sergeant Kafka. You and me both, lady. He's over there working on the gunship. We go over the bridge when he gives the word. Go talk to him if you want, but I'm in no hurry. You go. Why haven't you talked to him? Because I'm not stupid. This assault is damn dangerous. Dude, this guy looks like he's from Mass Effect 1. He looks wearing like aged armors. What's in here? What the heck? What do you want, freelancer? Man, shut up. I don't want excuses. Tell Kafka to get that gunship working, or he'll be next over that bridge. And somebody get me those damn blueprints now! What blueprints? Oh, am I supposed to talk to this dude? Can't. Carbs blood pack better wait for my signal. Get this freelancer out of here. I don't have time for this shit. What's your problem? You get, get this scum out of my face. Tarek, what seat in your ass? Oh, Zaid. Holy shit. Zaid has, has secret dialogue with this dude. Oh, that's cool. You know this asshole, Zaid? We worked together once. Since when do you work for so little? Since when are you a goddamn madman? You're talking to him. This guy's gonna kill me. Almost did already. That bad, huh? Worse. Look, Zaid. I gotta deal with this shit. Jinta, talk to these guys. Answer whatever questions they have. Good to see you. And who knows? Maybe you'll solve my problem for me. Anything's possible. <laughs> Good thing you know him. Tarek hates having to hire freelancers. He doesn't trust anyone outside the Blue Suns. You don't say. What can I do for you? Wait, hold on. So if I didn't bring Zaid, would that mean I won't get the secret dialogue? Oh. Um, I'm I'm actually just here to like banter. I don't. I'm not here for any actual conversation. See you. idea. <laughs> Make sure you check in with Kafka. Okay. Kafka. That armor really looks bad. Like the horizontal like lines don't help it. Sergeant Kafka. Oh, and it's cool. You must be the group Salky mentioned. You're just in time. Salky? Who the fuck Salky? Salky? You met him when you were dropped off. He radioed to say you were coming. You three kind of stand out from most of the other freelancers. Anyway, the infiltration team is about to give us a signal. Archangel won't know what hit him. Okay. Got any questions? This may be your last chance. Oh, he's smoking. No, don't fucking smoke in front of me, bro. Are you gonna give us cover with the gunship? Huh. Tarek is the only one who flies it. 
Besides, she's not quite ready. That bastard Archangel gave her a beating last time she was out there. In a few more tweaks, she'll be as good as new. Why are you coordinating the attack and fixing gunships? I'm in the infiltration group. Our team coordinates with the gunship. I'm staying back to organize the freelancers and make sure the gunship's ready to go if we need her. Okay. Are you coming? Let's go. Yeah, fuck, fuck, fuck the smoke. <laughs> Tarek doesn't Wait, I forgot to tweet I was going live. I just planned the attacks. <laughs> I just realized. Gunship. Answers get the privilege of. Target is in sight. Where a go? Check. Bravo team. Go, go, go. Uh oh. They're going in. Uh. Uh. Our somebody help me tweet on live now. I'm joking. Uh, I'm tweeting it myself. But that means no more waiting for me. Oh wait, hold on. Gotta get her back to a hundred percent before Tarek decides he needs her again. <laughs> you work too hard. You're working too hard. Ooh, baby. See ya. I never played ME. Is this serious? Like fifty percent cutscene? Yeah, it's a. It's um. It's marketed as a more. It's marketed as a more uh, cinematic sort of experience. Come on, give these guys a surprise. So it's fifty percent cutscenes, like dialogue. Oh shit. It's marketed as fifty percent. It's fifty percent shooting, like shooting gallery, and fifty percent like cinematics. Uh, the narrative is just as important as the gameplay. So they they really strike the hard balance of this game. Oh shit! Hello. And I think they struck a really good balance with this game. This honestly, valuable. this is valuable. Like I enjoy this game. Uh, I, don't, I don't say I don't say that really lightly. Honestly, most of the times I kind of like oh I want to see how the story pans out. So I put up the oh god fuck. Stop hacking the door. Enjoy. Burn through any armor. Have you played Deus Ex? I I have. I have. I played. Um. Okay. No. Um. That's a uh, two third of the truth. I played Deus Ex. Uh. The 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 two the two um remakes. They're not the remakes, right? Uh, Mankind Divided and Human Revolution. Um. And I tried playing the first one. Uh, tried playing the first one, so yeah. Uh, hey, welcome to the stream, Iron High. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How's your day? How's your day? How are you? How are you? Hey, 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 hey. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. Hello, King Pluton. Welcome, welcome. You never asked for this. Yeah, that's that's the that's the that's one of the good lines. All enemies accounted for. All right. I got the majority of the game. Couldn't finish it. I got so uninter uninterested with Deus Ex. I, it's fair because. Pro, the one from 2011? Ah, so the first remake, a remaster, or, or whatever. The sequel. No, it's a prequel. It's really understandable because it's a whole lot of, like, running up and down. And uh, it's open. I don't know. It's not for everybody, I feel. Now let's see who this fucking Archangel dickhead is. Archangel. Fucking Chunibyo looking. It's so open, you get lost. Yeah! And there are places that are just dead ass unaccessible, um, inaccessible rather, um, if you don't have the proper upgrades, and it gets really infuriating. Infiltration police station is the hardest thing in the game. Yeah, because it's either you bust through the front door and like die, or you, or you actually invest your points properly. It was the first mission. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you had to get the get the get the thing from the corpse. You had to get the aut autopsy or blah. Like unless you knew how how to infiltrate or the steps to infiltrate the the police station firsthand, I, uh, beforehand rather, um, it's really it's really not um, beginner friendly. I feel like that um, was it. Mankind divided, human revolution, one or the other. The twenty eleven one um, was not a really streamlined experience. Uh, a lot of uh, they want you to. They want you to feel the impact of your choices for skill points, but they they kind of went a bit too deep into that, so it suffers. The game suffers because of it. It's not good with it's not it's not easy for anybody who doesn't read a fucking prima guide before they play. Garrus, what 
you doing here? <laughs> just awkwardly just stand there for like 15 minutes, shot. five minutes. A little target practice. And just, yeah, it is. Okay. Been better, but it sure is good to see a friendly face. Yeah, it's Garrus. Marks is hard work, especially on my own. The whole time. And of course, he has really bad naming sins because uh, it's Garrus. All right. Whipping out the game before and tell me how to play the game is a non infuriating way. <laughs> yeah. Like actually buying the. God, fuck. I miss. I actually miss Prima guys. They're, re they're really cool to see on shelves in game shops. I miss game shops. I miss game shops that were. That, that were stocked with full of game stuff. <laughs> like. It's a bit it's a bit weird to say, but like I feel like game shops are now like fifty percent electronics more than um game related media, right? You gotta buy the adapters, you gotta buy the you gotta buy the the cover for your switch. You gotta buy the you gotta buy the the, 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 the PS4 controller, uh rubber 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 cover so you don't uh, damage your controller. But like I miss that era of printed media. Maybe it's just printed media in general. Remember GameStop used to sell phones? Actually? Wow. Now it's Minecraft plushies and shirts. Yeah, it's just like, it's it's not game um, related merchandise. Uh, not game related media. As much as it's merch, a merch shop. Yeah, it's a merch shop now. I guess. All right. Well, we got here, but I don't think getting out will be as easy. No, it won't. That bridge has saved my life, funneling all those witless idiots into scope. But it works both ways. They'll slaughter us if we try to get out that way. Just waiting doesn't seem like a good option. Got any other suggestions? This place has held them off so far. And I like his armor. Three of you. I suggest you see that we hold this location, wait for a crack in their defenses. The imperfection of his armor is really characteristic. Plan. Like but you see all plan. the, you see the little, yeah, yeah, in the previous shot you can see all the scarring and stuff on the armor, scratches. I like that. But um, game shops over here. Like, they don't sell phones, but they sell a lot of, like, card games and stuff. Because, like, it, it counts as games. If we fight as a team, we'll hold them off. You're right. Their numbers won't help them in here anyway. Let's see what they're up to. Why three? Why can't I have, like, four? A squad of four. I feel like four is hmm. better. Looks like they know their infiltration team failed. Take a look. Scouts. Eclipse, I think. Ooh. One less. Scouts. One less now, though. Indeed. We they stopped selling phones somewhere around the time the PlayStation here. phone came out. The PlayStation phone? Sorry? You? You what do you mean the PlayStation phone? Was that a thing? Just like old times, Shepard. Are you going to introduce me to something I never knew about? The Xperia? Uh, okay. The Xperia is pretty alright. Okay, time for me to actually do some work. Give me a second. I, 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 I. Where's my disruptor rounds? Okay. Is my AI hacking? I can't hit it all the way over here. Okay. Yeah, the Xperia Z series. I love those. I bought my one of my first active choices to buy a smartphone was this Xperia Z1, I think, or Z. Mainly because it's one of the first phones that were um uh waterproof. It was called the Xperia Play. Ooh, I'm gonna go look that up later. That sounds really cool. I love all like rare phones that got lost in time, like the N gauge. And the weird Nokia shaped ones. The sliding phone, two directional pads. What the fuck? Okay, I'm, I'm definitely searching up later. Thank you, Martin. Damn, Garrus, you kind of shit at shooting. Direct organ, trauma. Direct organ trauma. Oh, Martin, you're such a witty person. I'm gonna run out of ammo. Last shot. There we go. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna need to swap to my pistol instead. Did you own it? How did you know about it? This is, I'm training for Apex. Give me a second. I'm not Apex training. I get a wingman and I'll be like I need to hop up quick draw I have a rate vague recollection of random shit fair 
I know how that feels. Oh, shit. oh god, I'm missing all my shots. Thank you, Garrus. Oh, shit. Uh-oh, they're gonna infiltrate the, bu the fucking building. God damn it. Um, you mind actually shooting things? Okay. Yeah, I know how that feels. I recall- Oh, Jesus Christ. What are my skills? Totally forgot what my skills are. Why are there so many of them? Morden! Help me! Ah, shit. I'm forgetting how to curve skills. You can curve around corners. If you aim it right. Okay, that better fill up all my ammo. The sniper has so little ammo. Holy shit. It's not even funny. What the who? Holy shit. Freeze them ass. Okay. Good. Oh. Wait, what? Nice. Something done properly. All right, let's see how you handle this, Archangel. Go. Oh, nine. Oh, nine. Very cool. Huh? Eh, it's okay. That problem should take care of itself. Okay, I'm gonna swap back to my sniper rifle. Nice. Nice. Okay. Actually, you shouldn't be wasting my sniper shots. You know what? Fuck it. Ah, shit. Why are they not hitting one shot? It's kind of... I'll just let the mech take care of everything, honestly. I should actually help it so it lasts a bit longer. Oh, that's the, that's the, that's the, that's the captain. That's the captain. Oh, no, 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 no. They should punch through their armor. There we go. Was that the captain? This guy looks pretty strong. Ah, Ooh. You hear that? Excellent targeting. Oh shit. Morden said I had excellent targeting. Okay. Eclipse Trooper. Actually, I'll cloak so I get bonus damage. That's it? Okay. Change of the pistol for close range. Oh, that's okay. Mordo take care of that. Thank you. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's the king. That's the. That's the dude. The dude we gotta kill. And got it. Good. Oh, new, new sniper rifle. Oh, this new. Oh, a new assault rifle. Ah. I've got to regroup. I've got to loot the living shit out of your little, your little, little base. Gotcha. We'll stay close. Yeah, even now, I I kind of like remember bits and pieces here and there. Shepherd, I need you up here. It's not a very cohesive thing, my memory. Like something, oh, do you remember this this day? I'm like, uh, no. 
maybe I remember like what I had for lunch because it was really good or something, but like I don't recall I don't recall things and I don't recall why I recall things sometimes. Sometimes I remember like a random day of the year. Like, all right. There was this time when I was in the park with my mother and uh and this happened, right? I'm still up here, Shepard. Whatever, man. I'm looting. There's actually nothing to loot. But uh yeah. Also, there's dead people here, and for some reason they strap the dead people to the floor in, in this universe. I don't know how I feel about that. It's not like a bag, or is it supposed to like is it supposed to like you're supposed to like wrap it around the back? And it'll become a, a body bag? I don't know. It's so weird. I'm still up here, Shepard. So they don't float away. <laughs> okay, okay, that's a good that's a good take. That's a really good take. Yeah, when when the oh no, that's actually a really good take. Can you imagine like you're on a space station and the gravity fails? Oh, holy shit! That actually sounds legit. Nice one, nice one, nice catch. Yeah, I'm free. <laughs> okay, let's talk to our our lovely, lovely, our lovely host. You're kicking ass, Shepard. They barely touched me. I'm good at the game. We got Jareth in the process. I've been hunting that little bastard. Why were you after him? He's been shipping tainted Izo all over Citadel space. Half the goods I seized back at CSEC came from his team here on Omega. I took out a big shipment a while back and killed his top lieutenant in the process. Not surprised he decided to work with the other mercs after that. Nice. Corpus buddy, but for real though! You just sound so fucking scary. I know there was a game that had like floating dead body bag uh, body bags I forgot what it was it might have been like dead space or something we still got blood pack and blue suns left think we can make a break for it maybe let's see what they're up to they've reinforced the other side heavily but they're not coming over the bridge yet reminds you of cry of fear oh what sounds problematic Damn it. They breached the lower level. Well, they had to use their brains eventually. You'd better get down there, Shepard. What's cry of fear? I'll keep the bridge clear. Let's split up two and two. Keep one of my team here. You sure? Who knows what you'll find down there? Whatever is fine, man. Um, I think I'll get Zaid to stay. Horror Half-Life mod. Ooh, Zaid, okay. Stay with Garrus. Keep him alive. Dude, my boob armor Watch bends. Over. Look at that. Thanks, Shepard. It's weird. So it's elastic. It's not like a heart heart carapace piece kind of thing. We're on our way. Go down a level. The basement door is on the west side of the main room behind the stairs. I'll radio directions if you need help, but you've got to get down there quick. Good luck. All right, let's go, Warden. You can actually take both of your teammates along, but if you leave one of your teammates, his health drops slower, I think. Okay. Simple enough. I can't course. call him to go down there. Right? Not a problem. Oh, I can change weapons. Wait, there's no point because um. Wait, why is he using the vindicator? I need him to use the matic. Because stupid overpowered. Okay. Um. I'm not learning new weapons for myself. It's kind of sad. Can I run faster? Can I run for more than five seconds? Okay, here we go. Mm-hmm. I wish I could blind fire. There we go. Dude, my health is... My shield is so weak. I gotta rebuff my weapons because I opened the fucking locker. This was the thing. I'm glad I'm realizing now before I had to do it in battle. I'll just do, do it for everything. Uh, I can't buff my grenade launcher, so... The sprint screen wiggle is nauseating ammo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They wanted to, like, 
Oh shit. They wanted to emphasize like movement, but like they kind of failed. Dude, my shield can't take damage or shit. Where's. Did I. Did I tell Morden to like stay there? Oh my god. I don't want him to just come out and just like immediately die either, because it's really annoying. I'll just have him like park right next to me. <gasps> what? What? Why am I outside? Dude. Did, it, did they shoot over the thing? <gasps> no! Morden, you're blocking me! Okay. I'm gonna need to push up, Morden, um, for me. Thank you. Hold on. Uh, hi, hi, sleep, sleepy wave. Oh shit! Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream. Not a problem. Moving out of line of fire. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Is Morden dead? No? Okay, good. Oh no, my most don't work. <laughs> oh, come on, come on. Did he just friendly fire? I know there's the thing near the shutters. I just need to deal with the fucking big honking frog that dude. Freeze him. I don't want to deal with him for a second. Oh my god. Hello. Ooh, damn scary. How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? Freeze him. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Uh oh. Um fight, fight. I will fight. Whoop. Nice. Okay, okay. Here we go. Can burn through any armor, but you just whacked it on the fucking of on the on the on the random thing. Okay, okay, okay. it's a break. There we go. Whoa! Okay, I got this. Okay, and I'll poop. I'll disappear. Bye bye. Morden, would you like to use your scale? Oh, guess not. <laughs> when damn shutters open. What? Why did it stop? <gasps> no! Wait, why did it stop? Is it because, like, the, the dude got to it? Oh my god, fuck. Do I do that entire thing again? Thanks for the lurk. Thank you. Thank you. Dude here? No? Should do the trick. Nice. That's how I was able to Thank you, thank you, thank you. Find the large shutters and seal them. Flammable or inflammable. Forget which. Doesn't matter. There's not too many. Uh oh. Morden is dead. Oh my god. Please! No! <laughs> What difficulty is on this? On a uh, veteran, it's uh, one one step below the highest difficulty. I don't mind it though. It's, it actually gives me a challenge. If not, it's mostly just like a fucking cakewalk. It's it's either it's too hard, or it's too easy. That's the issue with the the, the difficulty settings in this game. And they just actually just inflate the numbers. That's all they do. Indeed. It's not like something that's a uh, gameplay related. Ah shit. Place behind here. Nice. Neutralized. 
Actually, should I give him the machine pistol? The best difficulty in, uh, in a, is oblivious, uh, whereas numerical for you change from zero to what zero to hundred. Okay, I've only played Skyrim, so. Trying. Taking cover. One down. Oh. Here they come. There's not too many yet. Wait, best as an ironic because it actually sounds like a really good way to scale it. We can scale it by number. Keep them back. You keep them back. I'm trying to fucking shoot them. Jesus. Your job, please, please. Oh my god. Oh my god. He got a shotgun. That's no good. <laughs> oh. Did he actually just hit the fucking wall? Here we go. No, not here. Get that shooter closed. We can't fight them on two fronts. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it, more than shoot it. For fuck's sake. It's nice, but it's also just funny. Yeah, like normally you'd be you're calling Pete, Peter. No, not Peter. <laughs> I don't want to get sued for animal abuse or something. I don't, I don't know. Do they actually sue people? <laughs> but yeah, like people go and thinking like you know, um, easy, normal, hard. But you give them a fucking slider, people are like, okay, so what does this do? What does it scale? Come on. Okay, taking more than might have been a mistake. Because I'm pretty squishy myself. VR man beats alien dog senselessly. Good. <laughs> I want that to be the headline. No, rather, rather, I, I need it to be a bit more uh, sens sensationalist. More sensationalist. VR man um, beats innocent uh, 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 space dog to death. Oh, Jesus. Jeez, that fucking, that fucking burned to death. Oh my God. Depressing. I need a better SMG. This sounds really creepy. That's that's not nice at all. You just a shot a fucking corpse. Wait, I can do a thing. Herman murders lovely space dog and his family and burns down their house. Okay, there we go. Oh, thank God. Get back here, Shepard. They're coming in through the door. What? Which door? Oh my God. Uh, rip them to shreds. Watch my back. I'll deal with Archangel. I think I remember. Oh, I'm back. Okay, I don't need to run all the way back either. Okay, that's good. Okay, here we go. Um. Okay. Oh, toggle my invisibility. So I get bonus damage. Morden, are you sure you just want to run in there? Are you actually sure? Because I think you might just, just like heal over and die. I'm not sure. Whatever, man. He's not like taking cover. There you go. Gotta take care of the big bad first. 
God, fuck. Okay, uh oh. Would you mind shooting the be dog charging towards us? Shoot the dog. Okay, that's that's not something oh, I want to be clipped for. Not if I kill you first. Haha. Simple enough. Yeah, I hear that mana going off. Let's go. Hey, fuck off. Bam. Wait, what? What do you hit the guy in the back instead? Doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense. Okay. Get the fuck back up. Wow, I'm being blocked by I'm being blocked by Zaid. Please. Here we go. Woo! Okay. Uh stop shooting me. Thank you. <laughs> okay, Cloak's actually kind of overpowered. <laughs> Ooh. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, that was rough. Do I, do I need more ammo? Does it replenish my ammo? I think it did. Okay, cool. Thanks, Shepard. They hardly got through to me. And we took out Garm and his blood pack. This day just gets better and better. Oh, yeah. This one tough son of a bitch. You fought with him before? Yeah, we tangled once. Caught him alone, none of his gang, to help him. We still couldn't take him out. I've never seen a Krogan regen that fast. He's a freak of nature. He just kept at it until his Vorcha showed up. It was close, but I had to let him go. Oh. this time. Let's go. Sons are left. I say we take our chances and fight our way out. I think you're right. Tarek's got the toughest group, but nothing we haven't faced before. Besides, he won't be expecting us to meet him head on. And uh. Shit. Okay. Like this? Damn it, I you guys I mind going to your positions? Let's go ahead. Oh, it's a chick that talked to us. Cool, get a killer now. Watch your back, Shepard. Why do I keep popping out cover? That is so weird. Goodbye. Sayonara. Morden's dead. The repelling down the sidewall. Ground floor. Uh oh. I'm out of midagel. Okay, okay, yeah, it's okay. Taking fire. They reached the rear stairs. The rear stairs. Simple enough. Ow! God. Let me shoot you. Thank you. Okay. Who's that? Heavy. Is that person with a shotgun? Uh, rocket launcher. Shit. Wrong thing. I'm trying to cloak. Here we go. You guys mind shooting? Thank you. you got it. Gosh, uh. oh, hell yeah. Okay, that it? What? Oh, what? Uh oh. No, my man. Garrus. What do I have an assault rifle? I don't recall this being an issue in the in the the original. 
Okay. Very easy. Let's do this. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh. I'll just do this. Eat some rockets? No. Seriously? You're gonna drop your moops off? After I took out so many? There we go. Easy. Okay, here it comes. Oh, come on. Whoop. Okay, next one. Whoop. What? Am I being shot from heck? Are you winning, Tengu? Yeah, yeah, I am. I think. It's a bit spooky, but I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm winning the video game. Oh, come on. That was that, that had to hit. <laughs> How are you? How are you, abu -san? How are you? Ah! All right, guys. Do, do my job for me. Kill the thing. Kill the kill the big bad. Oh, Jesus. Is it dead? Is it dead? Oh, I'm dead. See ya. Good job. I am awake. Okay. That's good. Hi, awake. I'm Vivi. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Vivi. <laughs> oh, what? Dude, that the fucking animation's we'll broken. Just hold on. He was supposed to have his eyes closed. Radio Joker, make sure they're ready for us. He's not gonna make it. He was supposed to have his eyes closed, and his eyes was like, like. Like snap open on that scene. Dude, the remaster ruined my favorite game. Alright. Mission finished. It was actually way faster than I thought. Commander, we've done what we could for Garrus, but he took a bad hit. No, Garrus. The doc's corrected with surgical procedures and some cybernetics. Best we can tell, he'll have full functionality, but... Shepard? <laughs> Tough son of a bitch. Didn't think he'd be up yet. Nobody would give me a mirror. How bad is it? <laughs> Hell, Garrus, you were always ugly. Slap some face paint on there and no one will even notice. <laughs> oh, oh, don't make me laugh. Damn it. Face is barely holding together as it is. Some women find facial scars attractive. Mind you, most of those women are Krogan. <laughs> He's so witty. I fucking love him. His fucking armor's still broken, though. Can we get to give him new armor? Worried about you, Cerberus Shepard. Do you remember those sick experiments they were doing? Oh, his dialogue changed. So in the original, if you don't import a save over, he's like, oh, I heard some bad shit about these Cerberus people. But now it's like, do you remember those sick experiments that we that they were doing that we actually foiled? That's cool. That's that's really cool. This is my like I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna say it again, because like this is my first time um importing the a Mass Effect 1 save over to Mass Effect 2. So I'm actually experiencing this for the first time. Not the actual game, but the Change dialogue and all the choices that I made, all the side quests that I did, and this is really cool. This is one of the, this is one of the small little details that I like. That's why I'm glad you're here, Garrus. If I'm walking into hell, I want someone I trust at my side. You realize this plan has me walking into hell too. Hmm. <laughs> Just like old times. Just like old do times. Whatever you need me, Shepard. I'll settle in and see what I can do with the forward batteries. Dude, the lighting for this scene sucks ass. 
The original one actually lights his face up properly. You can see all the scars. But this one just messes it up. Oh, the remaster has really destroyed this game. But I'm glad I'm still able to play it, okay? I'm not I'm not gonna bite the hand that feeds me. Uh, but I am gonna I'm I am going to um what are you thinking about? I am gonna criticize it. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, would like that actually. Talked about work earlier. Time with special tasks group studying genophage. It wasn't entirely honest. Lie of omission. Also, other kinds need to clear the air. Mission too important to keep secrets. Thank you, Morden. Work on genophage was more than just study. I fucking love Morden. I love the way he talks. Um, <laughs> it's gonna be. It's really embarrassing a bit, but like at one point in my middle school days, I actually kind of like started. I, I kind of started <laughs> imitating the way he speaks. Kind of like. Really short sentences, a little bit, um, just a little bit fast in talking, <laughs> but really concise, uh, concise and to the point. Um, I think I think that what I that's what I love about his um, speech pattern is that you get bits and pieces, but you get uh, these bits and pieces that are really straight and to the point. He that's how he is. He's a straight shooter. What was the special tasks group doing with the Krogan genophage? Study at first, as I said, but uncovered surprising data. Krogan population was increasing at faster rate than expected. Krogan were adapting to genophage, overcoming disease. So to briefly explain explain what the genophage is. It's basically um, they neutered the an entire entire species <laughs> with a fucking disease. Uh, so that a one in a million uh, born uh, rather out of a million born in stillbirth, only one um, will survive because the Krogans, the really big frog people, they breed really fast and they breed really quick. They're really quick and they breed in, in like, in like millions and in hundreds. They don't birth one by one. They birth like, like, you know, like frogs. And, uh, that's their, that's their, their answer to the, to the population boom that the, these frog people, uh, uh, have because they're really strong as well. Did the Krogan evolve, or did some of their scientists develop a treatment? Krogan scientists? <coughs> Never met Krogan scientists worthy of term. No. Natural evolution. Krogan physiology incredibly durable. Organ redundancy, backup systems, cellular regeneration. Genophage like any other natural hazard. Krogan evolved past it. Good news. The genophage was a terrible mistake. It nearly destroyed the Krogan and their culture. Now they have a chance to recover. Naive viewpoint. Krogan too dangerous to allow unchecked birth rate. Look at Krogan rebellions. Personally led a science team. Geneticists, chemists, sociologists, mathematicians. Created new version of genophage. Released it onto Chanka, other Krogan-centric areas. Restabilized Krogan population. So they made... They made the, the, the Rona vaccine. <laughs> they made the Rona vaccine. <laughs> They made the second shot. The initial induction, the in initial inoculation was the first shot. They had to wait until the, the body got used to it and then they, they gave it a second shot. <laughs> Yo, that shit, Mortner, that, that shit, uh, Pfizer, what is it? Sinovac? Uh, <laughs> I love it, I love it. You never considered other options? Hundreds, thousands. Modified genophage offered best outcome. Stabilized population, avoided publicity that could incite Krogan anger, averted potential genocide or devastating war. Best solution for whole galaxy, Krogan included. Oh. How did you distribute the modified genophage? Covert drops, hospitals, clan centers, water supplies. Very difficult. Few Solarians on Tuchanka. Team got caught a few times. Had to fight free. Messy. Better when things went as planned. Ah, uh, so they actually poisoned medicine. They poisoned the water. What the fuck? It's kind of messed up. That's like... <laughs> it's pretty messed up. How did your genophage modification work? Krogan evolution attached garbage genetic code to genophage attack sites. Modification created other areas for garbage code to connect. Left sites clean, capable, running smoothly. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm afraid I don't mean grasp grasp any of that. 
Uh, what? What do you mean go, go all the way? What the fuck do you mean go all the way? I can see what this is. If the Krogan are so dangerous, why not just sterilize them outright? Oh my god. Not a war criminal. Not a murderer. Genocide. Unnecessary. Krogan as a whole. Violent. Aggressive. Still. Ha have outliers. Worth saving. True. Age modification protect like Rex. the galaxy. Allowed Krogan chance to survive. Everyone wins. Good for us. Good for them. Genophage was a mistake bordering on a war crime. Recreating it is unforgivable. Don't want me on team? Don't bring me. Can stay here. Work on collector research. But no apologies. No. Did what was right. I think you're right, Morden. Hope you do the same if necessary. Even Should though you did work. kind of uh next time tissue synthesis has to compile. Good for free time. Okay. Even though you kind of um he kind of uh doomed an entire race and entire species to uh, I don't want to think about it anymore. Commander, can I help you with something? Yeah, sure. I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Wait, hold on. on I don't like that tone. Says ranks, Please. Not the alliance. No rules about fraternization. Your vote, your call. You want to get friendly with everyone? That's your business. I don't like that kind of tone. You don't want to be what? For now, just you. What? This is suck. It's a fucking mix. <laughs> Such mixed signal bullshit. Oh my god. Um, I don't want a relationship. I just want to be friends. I guess. You sound hesitant, Jacob. Am I putting you on the spot? You're trying to. Sorry if I knee jerked. Cerberus puts a lot of suspicion in your head. I like you, Shepard. So talk. And we'll All right, cool. Goes. Okay, okay, okay. I just want to like be friends with him so I get his trust mission. I think he's a cool guy. You seem okay with taking a risk on me. Why? Soldiers like us know how important trust is to the crew. I'm not used to seeing it on a Cerberus ship. Definitely not from people they put in command. But you focus on more than the job. A threat this big, you can't just throw people at it blind. They need inspiration. Okay. I want you to need me? What the fuck do you mean when you need me? Screw it. As long as everyone is inspired to do their jobs the way I ask, we'll get along fine. That works to a point. Trouble is, it's never obvious until it's too late. Ooh. Anyway, I should get back to prep. Nice talking to you, Shepard. Let's do it again sometime. Yeah, sure. He's a stand-up guy. I like him. I like people who are straight shooters. Don't like it when people beat around a bush. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Yo, I got a Twitter DM. What's up? <laughs> He's okay. Yeah, he's okay. I I don't I, I don't think bad of him. I just uh, the the only reason why I have like not a good impression of him is because I don't have any sort of um, I never actually used him a whole lot, um, and also like his his skill set and his weapon choice doesn't fit um the way I play. Uh, so reports tells us you've been operating the Omega Nebula. We'd like to look into a situation on Lorik, a nearby planet in the Fathor system. Scan the planet for a base where we believe Eclipse Mercs are holding one of our operatives. You should be able to detect the operative's uh, transmitter. Extract the operative if the operative is beyond rescue. Recover any relevant intel the, that Eclipse may have collected. This is a very delicate matter, Shepard. We trust in your discretion. Yo, I just read that with really little stutters. I'm, ama I'm amazed that I'm able to read things now. <laughs> Out loud, I mean. Hey, Ari gave me this address. I think I met you at Afterlife on Omega. You stopped me from joining up with those mercs who were trying to take out Archangel. Man, I was so pissed off at you. But I got drunk, blind drunk that night. And it was a few days later uh, before I got together enough to check the news vids. And saw almost all those mercs had gotten killed by Archangel. I don't know who you are or if you got out of there alive yourself, but thanks. I felt really stupid when I heard about the body count and how I could have been part of it. I'll make the most of what you did for me. John Whitson. Oh, that's the fucking, like, little punk with the fucking $50 pistol. Okay, cool. Nice. Omega Clinic Desk. Brenda, I wanted to thank you again for saving me from those Rotarians. I thought I've seen the worst of people's anger and fear at Dr. Souls' clinic. I had no idea how much anger this work was keeping in check, and how bad it really was. If not for you, I'd be dead. Thank you. The clinic is doing well. Uh, you got most. Uh, you got rid of most of the plague, and I've been able to handle the rest without too much trouble. 
The Blue Suns keep offering to take over security here. I keep the mech's part on. <laughs> I will make the same mistake twice. Thanks, Daniel. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, robots won't betray you for the most part unless they get hacked. Then that's on you. Um, let's talk to Kelly. How is our newest Turian crew member doing? His injuries look painful. This is tough. He's all right. He's a soldier. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. There's something about him. I just want to hold him close and whisper, it will be all right. Hey, yo, back off my man. Back the fuck off my man. Leave him alone. This mission is too important to be plagued with drama, yeoman. I understand. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? No, I'm not talking to you anymore. I'll be here if you need anything. Try to hit on my, 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 my brother with your, with your little, little whisper in your bullshit. Fuck you. <laughs> Ooh, a med bay upgrade. Okay, I can I can buy things now. I can buy some upgrades. Uh, I would like this actually. I'm biased because I'm use I'm I'm pretty much the only one that uses this like, mach machine guns for the most part. Uh, oh, the shotgun's really powerful, but I don't need it for the time being. Wait, I can. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to gonna talk to Joker. Kelly, you heard about Ferris Fields? Any news on your brother? He's gone. They're all gone. But we'll get them back. Shepard and Lawson are on it. We'll get your brother back and make sure the collectors pay for taking him. Okay. Commander, we got Garrus back. That's great, cause he was <laughs> totally my favorite. With that pole up his ass. Oh, oh, yet. Oh, there's no additional dialogue. Sure. That's it for now. See you, Commander. He just rotates in his fucking chair. I love it. That's really good. Oh, we're not in space. Not like a like a like just a flat thing. Edie, we got venting from the number sixteen lithium heat sink. Wait, I can close it. Oh, that's cool. Can I open it? Two years and everything hits the crapper. That'll teach you to die on me. Cool. You don't need windows in a in a spaceship. Well, that's cool. Mom can see me now. We have zombies on top of everything else. Oh. Hi Tengu. Hi Suki. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream. Welcome. I got hands. Hi. Thanks. Thank. Th hello. Hello. Thanks for. Thanks for tuning in. Hello. How are you? How was your day? How's your night going? My night's going great. It's going great. Oh, hold on. There we go. I'm having fun. I had a redemption arc for my for my week. So not my week, like my day. My day's okay so far. Hey, that's good. Let's go to here. Ferris Fields. Didn't Hadley have a brother stationed there? Oh. Yeah, he's taking it pretty hard. Holy shit, that ties up to the conversation upstairs. There's actually like a cohesive, like, um, crew chatter. That's good. That's good. All right. Time for the real shit. How may I help you, Commander? This is why I play Mass Effect. I have a present for you, Doc. Ceres Ice Brandy? You didn't. Thank you. I always regretted not opening that original bottle when I still could. I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now, you and me? Let's go. You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glasses. Shot, 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 Everybody. Jenkins back, but Jenkins popped up and yelled, that was awesome. Oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. With your service record, you could have gotten a tour of duty on any Alliance ship. Why'd you really leave? Maybe it's less about leaving and more about staying. As a military doctor, I mostly treat people who are in bad shape. Often they die. And if I can help them, they move on. 
Aquas, no. Don't you have any friends? They might look cool. No, not lacking friendship. Just stability. Same. Joker <laughs> will always have Brolic syndrome. He would never admit it, but he needs my help, and he always will. I wish it weren't, but sadly, it's true. Toast to friends. To the people we care for. Hell yeah. We never take them for granted. Hell yeah. That's good. That's a good toast. Man, now I want to drink. <laughs> now I kind of want to drink. <laughs> Whoa, shit. Oh, my. <laughs> my screen's weird because I'm drunk. <sighs> middle age. Mi middle school. Not middle age. <laughs> middle school me. You're like, oh, I'm drunk. I'm game drunk. And I'm not so drunk. Now we're the game drunks. Hydrate? Okay, okay. I'll just finish my water, actually. Mm. I'm off. Uh, enjoy the rest of the stream, people. See ya. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for dropping my unknown. Take those W's. Mm. And that's all my water. And I should probably do my wrist exercise as well. It's good because now I got the hand tracking. I can actually do it on, on, on stream. So what you do is like rotate, right? You rotate outward. And you rotate inward. Right? So you, you expand your... You take your hands out like this. Right? You stretch them back. And then you close your fingers one by one. Like one... It's not going to turn out really good. Um, so like your thumb, your index, your middle your ring and then your pinky and open up again and downward and upward and you know if you want to do it again just do it again the entire sequence okay cool there we go ah that's good that's good honestly i felt my my wrist being like uh getting a little bit stiff so that's really good oh she's just passed out oh i like chakwas a whole lot she's a in fact it's some of the non-combat crew the, the people that you don't really um bring the fights that really um paint the color of your ship uh that really like fleshes out your ship with their their character like the combat crew like the like garris miranda miranda morden cool yeah they're, they're, they're part of the main crew but like the but like the non-combat crew is actually uh, i think that's that's those are the few characters i really love and i really grew to love even shepherd need me for something yeah. Have you got a minute? Sure. Just checking the weapon system. You can never be too careful. I thought I'd seen every weapon in the galaxy in our fight against Saren. Mercenary work showed me otherwise. And now Cerberus rebuilds the Normandy with a few upgrades to boot. I wish we joined up with them sooner. Seriously? We haven't joined Cerberus. They're funding our mission. That's all. Relax, Shepard. Just a figure of speech. I can't exactly doubt your judgment. Not after I got my own squad killed. Oh, so though, so that's uh, the dead, um, the dead body stapled to the floor. Were it says crew. Um, squad makeup. Tell me about your squad. There were twelve of us, including me, former military operatives, CSEC agents, the usual. Had a Salarian explosives expert. Pretty sure he'd spent time in the special tasks group. My tech expert was a Batarian, believe it or not. Not the Ooh. friendliest guy, but he could hack any system ever built. What did your Merc squad do? So yeah, there's like own so little Motley crew. That's pretty cool. You saw Omega. It was full of thugs kicking the helpless. I formed my team to kick back. We weren't mercenaries. At least nobody was paying us. We made money by taking down slavers, pirates, or gangs that went too far. Uh, that sounds like, um, sounds like a gang. It sounds like you were just another gang. <gasps> oh, shit. Then I'm saying it wrong. We didn't shake anyone down. No civilian casualties. That was our rule. Every member of my team had lost someone to Omega's gangs. We weren't out to get rich. We were out to make those bastards think twice before murdering someone in the street. Ooh. Doesn't sound like you made any friends with the gangs. I got three separate Merc bands to work together to take me down. My manager at CSEC would be impressed. It was simple. Hmm. 
We'd hit their shipments, disrupt activities, get under their skin, make them angry. They'd come charging right into our well-prepared kill zone, crossfire and snipers, clean and surgical. They never stood a chance. Thanks for the look, J Chan. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope you're, hope you're having a good day. Hope you're having a good day. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How did those mercenary gangs take down your team? It was my own damn fault. One of my people betrayed me. Oh. Among us? Sedomis. He drew me away just before the mercs attacked my squad. Then he disappeared. Everyone except me is dead because of him. And because I didn't see it coming. Imposter? I'm not sure I understand. What happened exactly? Sedonis asked for my help on a job. When I got to the meeting point, nobody was there. By the time I got back to our hideout, the mercs had killed all but two of my squad. And they didn't last long. Ooh. Do you know where Sedonis is now? No. His trail vanishes after he leaves Omega, but I'll keep hunting. I lost my whole team except for Sedonis. One day I'll find him and correct that. That's Thanks for coming by, Shepard. I've got That's kind of dark. It's actually kind of dark. He didn't see the trade event. What a shame. <laughs> no, but he he pressed report on all the dead bodies though. <laughs> I don't know. I, I think uh, I think Blue's kind of sus. He's pointing fingers at Sedonis. Why oh, bet's red? <laughs> I don't know, Garrus. It sounds you, you sound kind of sus. You're the one pointing fingers. <laughs> okay, I'm actually here. To, wait, I gotta talk to Miranda as well. Shit, fuck. Oh, give me a second. <laughs> Miranda, would you like to tell me how your artificial well, goo was? Do you have a minute, Miranda? We well, can I romance her? I'm just finishing an operation report. I'm impressed, Shepard. So far, things yeah, have gone reports. I hate well. that. As Cerberus operations go, this is one of the best I've been a part of. Oh well, you know what? What else they say? I'm I'm best at. You want you want to know? They tell me I'm good at customer service. Hey. Maybe that's because this isn't a Cerberus operation. Not to you, maybe. But I report directly to the elusive man. And I'm here because he wants me to be. A Cerberus gave you a second chance, Commander. Maybe you should do the same for us. No. No, thank you. You're, it's like... He's trying to sell me... He's trying to sell me on... On... On fucking space KKK. I'm not... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna buy into that. He's like, oh, so uh, we 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 funded your resurrection, you know, we're the KKK, but we kind of like gave you a chance. Maybe you can give us the same chance. No. No fucking ulterior motive behind that. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not supporting. I'm not advo advocating space racism. Okay. What did Cerberus do that made you so loyal? Hmm. I suppose you deserve to know. Of course. Do you remember when I told you how I was genetically altered? Uh-huh. Well, that wasn't my choice. Oh. My created me. Yeah. He's a very influential man and extremely controlling. He didn't want a daughter. Okay, that's bad. He wanted a dynasty. I ran away as soon as I was old and brave enough. I went to Cerberus because I knew they could protect me. That's bad. I, oh, dude. Like, I've, I, hear, I hear horror stories like about really controlling parents. And, and it sucks because like oh God, I got friends I got friends that kind of stuck on this kind of like um families and and it's it sucks because I can't do anything and, and I try I try I try to like hear them out but there's so little I can do and they kind of realize and they kind of just stop talking to me it's kind of sad <laughs> I don't know I, I I try I assume that Cerberus approves of your enhanced abilities of course Cerberus fully endorses anything that advances the cause of humanity. Ooh. Genetic alterations included. Oh. I don't like my father and his own selfish reasons. Cerberus and the elusive man believe in a greater good. They see the bigger picture. And I feel like I have a purpose here. I don't know. I think that kind of sounds like Stockholm Syndrome, Chief. I don't think... Um, I don't think 
That's healthy. You talk about yourself like you're just a tool to be used by your father, by Cerberus. Maybe. I like to know where I fit in the world. It helps me find meaning in how I was created. Mm. You are who you are, Miranda. We don't need to make excuses for it. That's easy for you to say. We've both been engineered for greatness, Shepard. The difference is you were great before we rebuilt you. I'm great because of it. It's actually kind of... It's actually a really good line, actually. See, this series is filled with good one-liners. Like... Not like funny ones, right? There's definitely funny ones, but like... It's, 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 it's lines like this that kind of hit you. Like, the difference is you were great before we rebuilt you, yeah? But I'm great because we rebuilt you. Like, what the heck? Damn, you reading like Shakespeare, woman. I like it. Your spirit and personality are what make you great. Yo, we're talking about spirit and anyone, space. Right? That's kind of you. I'm not sure I believe you, but thanks for saying it. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, that's it? Okay, sure. Thanks for your time, Miranda. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, Commander. Mutual appreciation and um, it, it is a really good thing. Appreciation? I don't know. I just realized her name's isn't spelled like Shepherd. What do you mean? What do you mean? My name? What? What is it? H after P? Oh wait, I'm leveled up. Okay. Oh wait, no, it's good. I don't need it. Um, there's nobody else to talk to. Morden, talk to. Jacob, talk to. Nobody else. Okay. Yeah, it's not Shep Shepherd. Shepherd. Okay. Oh, we're done with, um... We're done with Omega. We're finally done with, um... With the space slums. I thought there was H after there and wasn't. I've been lied to. No! <laughs> Recruit the convict. Um, I don't know. Recruit the warlord. Who's the warlord? Help Zaid. Citadel. Are there any um side quests? This is DLC. I'm not gonna do the DLC after I'm done with the with the uh, the main game. So uh, that's a uh, that's something to keep in mind. Um, I'm gonna go to Citadel. I wanna go do some shopping. Maybe a side quest. I don't think there were side quests in this game, actually. Give me a second. Um, my fuel. I got to top off my drones as well. I, I mean probes, fuck. No, the Obama, the Obama administration. Okay. Yay. Um, space, space Switzerland or something. I don't know. Ooh. Oh man, this R2 looks so good. Yo, we st we still get we still get parking space even though we're kind of like technically a terrorist organization. Okay, Citadel's kinda whack. <gasps> yeah, girls. I'm gonna bring um more, I, I'm so apprehensive of bringing Morden now because he keeps hitting my his skills against the wall. I'm gonna just bring two heavy he hitters. Hit heaters. Hitters. What are their skills? Disruptor ammo and consistent shot. This one's consistent shot overload. Okay. I can give him new, new armor. Oh, it's white and red. Cool. Um, Screw it. I'll bring Morden. It's fine. I need his, need his powers. Yay! Garrus! Ooh, he's fixed up. His armor's fixed up. That's good. I need overload. That's the one I'm lacking. In my team setup, so I'm glad you're here, Garrus. Is uh, I need I need that anti shield tech. Um, okay. Yep. 
there is one DLC. There is DLC I'll be doing though before I complete the game. Um, and that's the DLC for uh, getting like team members and stuff. So the first one was Zaid. Commander Shepard, enter the password and receive a free gift. And the second one's Kasumi. Please tell me your password, Commander Shepard. Wait, I can see your eyes. No, that's bad. Ugh, this remaster is really like taking the really really pissing me off. Silence is golden. Good to finally meet you, Commander Shepard. Kasumi Goto. I'm a fan. So Kasumi Goto um, is a kind of a world uh, galaxy renowned thief, uh, and the problem is the fact that in the second game and in the third games, the hood over her eyes, like cast a shadow over her eyes. Like a really black shadow, you can't see anything, and for some reason you can see it now. It's kind of fucked me up. Has Cerberus filled you in on the mission? Honestly, I'm shocked they didn't come to see me sooner. Yeah, it's, it's bad. Find, I guess. It's really bad. What's with the password and the sneaking around? Are you in trouble or something? I'm the best thief in the business, not the most famous. Need to watch my step to keep it that way. I also needed to make sure all this was legit. And I have no doubts now. You're the real Commander Shepard. What brought you to Cerberus? That's a bit of a story. Short version, they were looking for me, so I trailed them to find out why. Turns out they were looking for someone to join you on an important mission, and were offering a serious signing bonus. I had a thing I needed help with, so I made them a deal. And here we are. What, what's, the, what's the bonus? I don't want the bonus. They didn't give me no bonus. Fuck. But I wish I got a bonus. I want a bonus. I assume this deal is something <laughs> I should know about. Yeah, I guess it slipped their minds. I'm looking for my old partner's gray box. A man named Donovan Hawk took it. And I'm planning to get it back. Do the oh the 60 FPS suit's really good though. Like do that position. I mean they rebuilt your body to a sign up bonus. Okay. No, I think I think that's that's kind of a condition they have to <laughs> they have to fulfill before giving me a bonus, you know. Before it, actually hiring me they have to actually like resurrect me <laughs> or else they're just resurrecting my remains they're actually like um recruiting my remains um we'll take care of it that's what cerberus promised you we'll get it done it'll be fun and oh that's a good fun. shot you won't even have to draw your gun. ah yeah this, this is good this is good this is good you never saw her eyes we should probably wrap this up you look pretty silly standing there talking yeah and, and now you see her eyes it's so inconsistent Ah, there we go, there we go. That's a good one as well. Her eyes were always kind of glistening underneath the shadow. Ooh, what? But it was never actually exposed, and uh, that's kind of poopy. Ooh, talk to Morden about Keeper? What does he have to say about Keepers? Keepers. Fascinating creatures. Genetic constructs adapted to work in Citadel. Couldn't survive outside. Unknown purpose. Wish I could have studied them. Had other things to do instead. I like his deep breath before he talks. Look at it. I like his armor. I like his outfit. Look at him. Look, there's a little um uh like ser like what do you call it servo? I don't know, like the little leg supporter thingies. And his bracers. I love Morden's outfit so much. It's easily one of my favorite. Maybe I'm biased because of the colors. I might be biased because of the colors, but like it looks good to me. And Garrus, nice looking armor. I'm glad to use. The Destiny Ascension has completed its 20 colony victory cruise. Council members aboard thanked human alliance soldiers for their efforts in repelling Saren's invasion two years ago. No. Oh. They're on a fucking victory lap? What's this? I'm sorry, sir, but I'll what? need you to remove any biotic amp you might be wearing. What? Why? Unfortunately, sir, biotics can be used as a weapon. The rules require me to confiscate all amps. Could you please hand over yours? I don't have one. I'm not a biotic. Oh. Well, when you objected, I thought... You humans are all racist. Ooh. Wait, Garrus, you're talking... Oh, fuck. Can't get the Garrus dialogue anymore. Oh, I love this one. This is a really good one. This is a 20 kilo ferrous slug. Feel the weight. Every five seconds, the main gun of an Empress-class dreadnought accelerates one to 1.3% of light speed. 
It impacts with the force of a 38 kiloton bomb. That is three times the yield of the city buster dropped on Hiroshima back on Earth. That means Sir Isaac Newton is the deadliest son of a bitch in space. Now, serviceman Burnside, what is Newton's first law? Sir, an object in motion stays in motion, sir. No credit for partial answers, maggot. Sir, unless acted on by an outside force, sir. Damn straight! I dare to assume you ignorant jackass know that space is empty. Once you fire this hunk of metal, it keeps going till it hits something. That can be a ship, or the planet behind that ship. It might go off into deep space and hit somebody else in 10,000 years. If you pull the trigger on this, you are ruining someone's day, somewhere and sometime. That is why you check your damn targets. That is why you wait for the computer to give you a damn firing solution. That is why, serviceman Chung, we do not eyeball it. This is a weapon of mass destruction. You are not a cowboy shooting from the hip. Sir, yes, sir. That's really good. I like, I like this little, uh, com oh, oh, what are you guys looking at me? Sorry? Sorry. Am I intruding? Okay. <laughs> Social distancing. Alright, got it. <laughs> I love this, 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 I love this little bit of dialogue. I love, I love the fact that it's actually, um, common sense to learn physics in this, in this world. I feel like there's a lot of people that don't. Um, remember physics even though they've kind of been taught or uh, been told I don't know it's, it's nice it's a nice little bit of detail oh, listen to it this recruits is a 20 kilo ferris oh every five seconds, okay the main gun of an Empress class Wait, can I talk to him? can I help you ma'am it's been a couple years since I passed through here security seems to have tightened a bit after the Geth attack, there was a review of security protocol. A few minor changes were made to reduce the risk of Geth infiltration. We apologize for Geth the infiltration. You'd think a Geth would stand out. Assumptions are dangerous. Be alert. Be safe. Thanks for your time. Next. Um. Ah. Uh, sorry. Looks like they've tightened up security. Shut it down. What? Do you seriously think? Yeah, okay. Sorry for the inconvenience, ma'am. Our scanners are picking up false readings. They seem to think you're uh, dead. I was listed as missing in action a couple years ago. Would you mind checking in with my captain? He can reinstate you in our system. He's just past the scanners on your right. <laughs> You'll have to make him scream a little. He's not going to tell you everything just because you ask. I, I know, sir. If you don't have the stomach or you're worried about being reported, I can take care of it. No, sir. I can handle it. Yes, I see the problem already, Commander Shepard. My consul says you're dead. Yeah. Yeah, it kind of was. You're not worried I'm some imposter claiming... Imposter? We have the best screening equipment in the galaxy. Those Imposter? can sample DNA from skin flakes. Hell, <laughs> if you have unregistered gene mods, they can even figure those out. Your sergeant said you could help with that. Vent him, yeah. You'd have to go through the station security administration. I know, baby. You're looking kind of sus. <laughs> You're looking kind of, uh, kind of pointing fingers. Probably a stop by the treasury. I think imposters are the ones that always start pointing fingers. The first. But Roma, see, welcome, welcome, welcome so to the stream. Thank you for the four thousand points. Right total four thousand points. Yo, you got the magic button. He's not. He's gonna go into the back and check for stock. It's really cool. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello, Roma. How's your day? How's your day? Hope you are well. You're not big on formalities, are you? I'm with them right up until they keep people from doing their job. Whoa, we're finally fifty percent done in a month. Yes. I just saved you about Thank you, baby. That said, you should head up to the Presidium and tell them you're still alive. The council probably wants good, to good. Ah, good to hear, good to hear. Thank you, thank you. I'm happy, I'm happy. Screw the council. Nah, I'm going up there. I will. Having access to the council and the Spectre's resources would be useful. Yeah. The council can get anything. 
Best thing about working CSEC is that any equipment, information, or money you need, you get. His expression is anyway, really stiff now. Yeah, yeah, this is the one. Or can I get back to work? It's kind of like half broken, some of the animations. I should be going. It's really sad. You need anything else? Let me know. Oi. Oh, I can do the thing now. Wait, hold on. I don't think I have enough. Do I have enough? Let's see. Wait. So do you want Space to hamster. Maybe a model ship? How is a model ship supposed to remind me of the Citadel? It's festive and you like ships. I'm an engineer, honey. I look at ships all day. Oh, that's cute. Good day, my friends. Welcome to the Citadel. Oh, I can do the thing. Here we go. <laughs> accuse her. You accuse her for classes. Dude, I love the renegade options. All right, here we go. Since these stores are owned by the council, do government employees get a discount? Yes, in fact. Uh, what's your position? I'm a former specter. My goodness. I didn't know specters quit. I don't believe you qualify for a discount, though. How about if I throw in an endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren? You or Shepard? My goodness. The increase in sales would certainly be worth offering a discount. What do you need me to do? Just voice your endorsement into my <laughs> console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Excellent. Oh, <laughs> we to add it to our advertising immediately. She said it. She said the line. <laughs> I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store in the Citadel. Oh, yeah. Oh? Why? It's a fish. Fish have nothing to do with the Citadel. Besides, it'll be dead in a couple of years. The important thing is to embrace the time that you have to spend with a fish. Oh, for... Is this the lifespan talk? I'm not having the lifespan talk. Oh. So the blue aliens on the right live up to, about, I think, about like a century plus. Uh, the bird person on the left lives with me about like 50... No, about like... 100? 80 maybe? So, um... It's, 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 uh... Wait, no, not like, maybe a few centuries even. The, the blue aliens. Wait, 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 okay. So I walk away. Okay, I walk back in. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. <laughs> and that's gonna play for every single, every single shop I go to and get the discount in. Right, let's see what's in here. Space hamster! Oh, I want the space hamster. Fish. Uh, I'll buy the fish another time because I, I'm too. I, I won't be feeding them all the time. I need to unlock the auto feeder. I heard that those lakes up on the Presidium are filled with fish. No, they're not. You ever been up there? No, CSEC won't let me. They say I'm a risk. Uh, they think every Krogan is dangerous. Damn Turians. Just kill them. Okay, okay, okay. That's kind of why they think you're a risk, okay, Chief? You gotta, you gotta listen to yourself sometimes. <laughs> yeah, be aware of the of what you're saying. <laughs> alright, 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 alright. I think I can buy guns here. What can I do for you? Your expeditions might be a little tame for me. Tame? A human can hardly take down a feral Verit, let alone a Shatha. Who do you think you What's are? What's a Shatha? Well, my name's Shepard, and I... the Shepard, the one that put down Saren Artemis. Put down? <laughs> oh, you do know me. By the spirits, Shepard, in my store. I don't suppose I could convince you to record an advertisement for me. Sure you can. Here we go. Can we work out a discount? A discount? I'd name my firstborn after you if you ask. Can we record it now? Just speak towards my console. I'm going to Shepard, and this, and this is, my is my favorite, favorite store, store in the Citadel. Citadel. <laughs> no other gun shop has that kind of endorsement. I don't know, Chief. I'm kind of walking around giving endorsements left, right, and center. You, you got a, you got a few, you got a few shops you got to be fighting with. <laughs> oh my god so great and scissor oh i like this one i think umbra okay sentry interface okay these are actually really good armor pieces and uh weapons i will i will buy them oh this one's so expensive the upgrade 
I'm gonna buy all of these. Uh, so I've got, like, um, things to pick from. Um, sniper rifle damage, yes. Wait, hold on. Oh shit, oh, that was a lot of money. Okay, 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 I'm not buying, I'm not buying. I'm not buying the upgrades. The upgrades are so expensive. Space game, stop! It's based on Turian mythology, but it's really fun. I hear it has 11 billion players now. Have you heard of the critically acclaimed MMORPG Galaxy of Fantasy? Now with a free trial, including uh, 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 the Grace game, uh, a space, uh, 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 the Galaxy Reborn, and up to the, the award-winning expansion, Galaxy Ward. Up to the level 60, with no limits, on game time. I don't know. I try my best. I try my best. <laughs> Do you have any games you'd like to trade in? You get two credits toward a new game. It's Space Game Stop. I love Space Game Stop. This one's so fun. It's like really tongue in the cheek humor. I love it so much. Okay, game no, relax. Good. Alliance Corsair. The battles are pretty realistic, but it's still fun. And you can install it on an Omni tool. You're talking about Alliance Corsair, the hit social mobile game. I mean, a Omni Omni tool game. Dude, I have a level 100 um um, um vindicator class on that. You should we should share friend codes. Oh my god, I fucking love this so much. Credits. We offer data protection for any game we sell. If copy protection ever malfunctions. You can download a new copy free. Wait, was this a thing back then? It sounds like DRM. It's actually trying to sell me DRM. No, thank you. I don't like DRM. Those Asari Hanar porn. Okay, okay. Are really nasty. Okay, okay. No, no, no. <laughs> We're out of here. That that's where that's where I peace out. Ooh. Okay. The people want to hear your story, Shepard. Yeah, sure. All right. Police have been seen in Aljalani, Westerland News. Yeah, who the f I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a specter. You presented your case very well on camera. Do you have a minute? Punch out. No, don't spoil it. Don't spoil it. So you can try to do another smear job on me. Now, Shepard, you may object to my methods, but we're on the same side. Your bad, your news. I just want to give your story its due. Ah! It's really bright. Wait, the lighting's on the wrong side. Dude, this game's broken. Gara <laughs> just pieces out and then one be on in frame. Oh shit, I want to punch him. This store is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends commemorating 167 years anniversary. Come join us. Oh my god. lost 20 cruisers. Figure each had a crew of around 300. The Ascension, the Asari dreadnought we saved, had a crew of nearly 10,000. But surely the human cost. The Alliance lost eight cruisers. Shen Yang, Emden, Jakarta, Cairo, Seoul, Cape Town, Warsaw, Madrid, and yes, I remember them all. Everyone in the Fifth Fleet is a hero. The Alliance owes them all medals. The Council owes them a lot more than that. And so do you. Ooh. Commander Shepard, first human specter. Hero of the Battle of the Citadel. Check bid. We get it? Great. Bull rushed on my own show. Oh, oh, that's actually really good. Oh, man, I kind of... Like, I would love to punch her for the meme, but, like... That's actually a really good comeback. That's actually really good. Uh, I would love to go to the the bar and have fun, but um, yeah, no, no, thank you. Okay. I think I'm going to do an ME one. I don't think I'm, uh, but I'm not positive about that. What punch her? This meeting would be more productive if Udina was to join us. My advisor is unavailable. As counselor, I represent the voice of humanity. And what are they the asking, arts. asking for you, Gina? Fuck, fuck off. Shepard will be here. And... Oh, commander, we were just talking about you. And this is my first time playing 
this section of the game with my choice of picking Captain Anderson as the council member, the human council member. And I'm really, really happy because fuck, I hated dealing with Udina. It's been a long time, Anderson. I hope the last couple years have treated you right. There have been some rough spots. It's good to have you back. We've heard many rumors surrounding your unexpected return. Some of them are unsettling. We called this meeting so you could explain your actions, Shepard. Oh, they're VTubers. After all, you saved our lives in the battle against Saren and his Geth. Yeah, you bet. The Collectors are abducting human colonists in the Terminus systems. Worse, they think they're working for the Reapers. The Terminus systems are beyond our jurisdiction. Your colonists knew this when they left Council Space. You're missing the important part, Counselor. The Reapers are involved. Ah, yes, Reapers. <laughs> The immortal race ah, of yes, sentient reapers. starships allegedly waiting in dark space. Uh, we have dismissed that claim. All right. Shepard, no one else encountered the hologram on Ilos that told you the truth about the Reapers. Only you and your crew ever spoke with Sovereign. I believe you. But without evidence from another source, the others think Saren was behind the Geth attacks. So, yeah. Um, when... When you play with the the save that Emmy to, uh the, the the game gives you without you importing the Mass Effect one save, Udina's the Udina's the 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 the, the council member. Uh, and the problem is the fact that he sandbags you on top of the the council sandbagging you, and it becomes so fucking aggravating. And I'm glad I ha I put I picked Anderson because he actually makes some sense of the situation, rather than just like. Oh yeah, the the Turian person is right because uh uh because I have to remain uh diplomatic. I'm like fuck off. <laughs> Saren was an organic. The Geth would never accept him as their leader. They only followed him because he was Sovereign's agent. Saren was a compelling and charismatic individual. He convinced the Geth the Reapers were real, just as he convinced you. It was uh, part of his plan off. to attack the Citadel. The Reapers are just a myth, one you insist on perpetuating. We believe that you believe it, but that doesn't make it true. What's that supposed to mean? If you believe that I believe it, wouldn't you believe it by extension? Oh, it's like a dream in a dream shit already. What the f yeah, that's so stupid. That's a, such a stupid line. That's such a stupid thing to say. Go back to Ilos and talk to Vigil. Or just look at what's left of Sovereign. It's obvious the technology is more advanced than ours. The hologram on Ilos is no longer functional, and we have found nothing to suggest that Sovereign was not a Geth creation. The Geth are capable of remarkable technological achievements. This is probably why Saren recruited them. This Reaper theory proves just how fragile your mental state is. You have been manipulated by Cerberus, and before them, by Saren. Uh, shut the fuck up. I kept Saren from conquering the Citadel. I sacrificed human lives to save this council. We are in a difficult position, Shepard. You are working for Cerberus, an avowed enemy of the council. This is treason, a capital offense. That's too far. Shepard is a hero. I'm on this council too. Hell yeah, Anderson. Whitewash continue. Maybe there yeah. is a compromise, not a public acknowledgement given your ties, but something to show peripheral support. Shepard, if you keep a low profile and restrict your operations to the Terminus systems, the Council is willing to offer you reinstatement as a Spectre. Oh. Cool. What, wait, wait, what do we mean, sir? Because they, they took me off the Spectre system because I... They took me off the Spectre because I died? What does that mean? Will I need to start filing reports? That won't be necessary. This is a show of good faith on our part. We cannot Aww. become involved in an investigation regarding the missing colonies in the Terminus systems. But Spectre reinstatement shows our support of you personally. Okay, that's... That's fair. Because the Terminus systems are like this outer rim um, set of um, galaxies? What do you call it? Um, planets? Galaxies. Systems. Um... They are, they are outside of the sphere of influence of the, the Citadel. So it's like the, 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 the Wild West, the, uh, the, the chaotic um, outback of space. So it's fair that they can't just say, oh, we're sending this person into the Turbine Systems and cause like a big diplomatic hoo-ha. So, um, okay, okay, that's fair.
I accept your offer. It's good to have the Council on my side. Good luck with your investigation, Shepard. We hope for a quick resolution and a quick end to your relationship with Cerberus. Yeah, me too, actually. Dude, I got a good ass! That went better than expected. You realize the Council's offer is just symbolic. They won't actually do anything. Uh, but I mean, it's fair enough. Even if they don't help, I might as well stay on good terms. True enough. Don't worry about the Council or the Alliance. I'll find some way to keep them off your back. Shouldn't be Thank too you, long. Anderson. As long as you keep to the Terminus systems. Anderson, we need to talk about... Shepard. What are you doing here? Wait, this, I'm getting deja vu. Is Anderson the default choice? If you start with the uh, Mass Effect 2, a new game? Hmm. Stop by to see how Anderson was doing. You don't have to cover for me. I invited Shepard here to speak with the Council. We just finished our meeting. You what? Counselor, do the words political shitstorm mean anything to you? <laughs> the Council reinstated my Spectre status. They're just happy I'm staying out in the Terminus systems. Yes, I could see how that arrangement works best for both sides. But you really shouldn't have taken a step like this without consulting with me first, Counselor. I don't answer to you, Udina. Yeah. Why don't you go to your office and think about that for a while? Ooh. Of course, Counselor. Good day to both of you. <laughs> he effectively told Udina to fuck Sorry, right off. Udina's never gotten over the fact that I got the council position instead of him. Sometimes I need to put him in his place. Good. That's a really good. <laughs> go to your room. Yeah. He just straight out fucking banish Udina back to the Shadow Realm. That's really good. I like that a whole lot. Destroyed epic style. Yeah, just destroy the politics. <laughs> destroy. Destroy the politicians. Destroy the diplomatic ties. I mean, like, no, but like. <laughs> Diplomacy works, but. To an extent. There's a, there's a point where you kind of start sacrificing your basic humanities for diplomacy and it gets a little bit weird. Yeah, but fuck with you, honestly. And I like I like the fact that he gives the impression of like fuck Udina because that's that's it's good to be able to play a character well enough for people to hate you. Udina's just doing his job. True. True. He's got his uses. And if you want something done on the Citadel, he knows who can make it happen. Plus, he's always happy to attend all those formal diplomatic functions I can't be bothered with. Okay. How are you, Anderson? How are you, Chief? How have the last couple years treated you? Serving on the Council isn't how I plan to spend my twilight years. Sometimes it feels like I'm just beating my head against a wall. I'm sorry, Anderson. Knowing the truth about Sovereign is brutal. It's nightmare stuff. I can't blame others for not wanting to believe it. But I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? No. Oh. I know you can't come with me, but I'll ask anyway. Forget Udina and the Council. Join my crew and help me stop the Collectors. <laughs> I'm too old to go racing across the galaxy. Much as I complain, I've got an important job to do here. The front line. That's got to be yours. All right, Anderson. Where's Caden? Yeah, where's Caden? What happened to Staff Lieutenant Alenko after the Normandy was destroyed? Staff Commander Alenko is still with the Alliance, but he's working on a special mission. He's a commander it's now. I can't say any more. Not while you're working with Cerberus. I'm sorry. Wait, did they actually tell you? Um, I better go. Of course, Shepard. I understand. I wish I could do more to help you. But if you ever want to talk, I'll be here. To tell Just you? Do me a favor and be careful. You can't trust Cerberus. Yeah, I don't. It's okay. Did I actually tell you what happens to Caden or Ashley in Mass Effect 2? In like a comic or something? Maybe? Alright, this is the only part of the Presidium I can actually visit. The moment I go here, I gotta pick somewhere else to go. Yeah, okay.
All right. Uh, do a bit more shopping. This is a thief, and I want oh, side quest. Arrested. What? I was just walking by. I'm sorry. I'm trying to take a statement here. There's nothing to talk about. She stole my credit shit. Arrest her. I did not. Just because I'm a quarian. I need you to stop and take a deep breath. You're mocking me, Earth Clan. Just because the Vault Clan need. It was a poor choice of words, sir. I apologize. Damn, this guy's got his fucking hands full. I'll help I'll him see out. See if I can find out what happened. Ma'am, this is a C-Sec matter. We'll do all we can. <sighs> all we can to resolve this. We don't need civilian help. If you do happen to find the chit, please let one of our officers know. Let's go. Be careful out there. Okay. Hey, what's this? I just got a refund in exchange, and I was told to pick up a new army jail converter here. I don't think you have the right place. No, they said to go to the warehouse. This is the warehouse. Oh. Wouldn't a refreshing, delicious Tapari sports drink hit the spot right now? Yes, it would. If I could go for a Gatorade. Oh my God. Did it? <laughs> oh shit! It's actually working. The marketing's working. I wanna, I wanna have a great Gatorade right now. I'm addicted to Gatorade. Look, it took me a long time to get this refund. It's a Cision Omnigel converter. He said there'd be one waiting for me. Do you have a service order? No, I got the refund, made the exchange, and then he said go to the warehouse. Like, I, I'm not addicted to Monster Energy. I'm addicted to Gatorade, if anything else. I think about more about Gatorade than Monster Energy. Sent me here. Come on, why do I need a service order? The wards market? Why would you come to his Akara Ward warehouse? He said they're out of stock and I should go here. He didn't say anything about a service order. Without a service order, I really can't help you. Ugh. Ooh. Bureaucracy. Hey, is there an end to the story? Wait, this was a trick, wasn't it? He sent me to the wrong place just to get me to leave. I wouldn't know anything about that. I've been trying to get this refund for two years. Two years! Not giving up now. You'd get a lot farther in life if you just held on to your service orders and receipts. Ooh. Yeah, hold on to your uh your invoices, guys. Just in case. What do you think, Michael? Maybe the immuno booster? It's supposed to help with alien bacteria. We can get whatever you'd like, or little Jake, Rebecca. Well, <gasps> the immuno booster can delay muscle development in high gravity environments. Wait. What if that hurts him? I think this is the couple that I uh that I helped um solve their little family dispute because they were like, "Oh, should we get a treatment for the baby to protect it against uh foreign infections?" And the mother was like, "Oh, if if we get that, uh it it's been said to cause some side effects, some bad side effects for the baby." And I went in there and like helped out. I think this is the couple. Not couple. It's like the uncle and this is the the, the mother. It was it was oddly anti-fax. Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation outlet on Zakara Ward. Oh? Avolus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chip? And not that I saw. He didn't purchase anything. Okay. Let's go. I couldn't help but notice your prices. They seem a bit steep. With respect, the Foundation is not concerned with profits. A portion of our sales funds research to cure genetic diseases. You know, it would make your services more popular. An endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren. Oh my! You're Shepard, aren't you? Just throw my fucking name my around. Discount if you would do that for us. It's a deal. Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. <laughs> she said the line. Our advertising at once. Thank you. Okay. What does she have? Meta gel and life support webbing. I like to pick this. Wait, how much is this? Oh, it's pretty cheap. All right. I would like more meta gel, but I don't have the money the to afford all that. Say that there are occasional motor control sites. I'm Commander Shepard, and this. I just. He's my baby. He's all I have left of Jacob. I know. I just want to protect him. I know. I'm not being irrational, Michael. I know. Okay, can I get more? Can I get more dialogue out of him? I'm actually really curious how how the story ends. I trust you, Michael. 
What medical upgrades do you want to get for him? I don't know. Maybe we should ask random people on the street what they think. I'm getting the immuno booster and a drink. <laughs> okay. I think this is where the thing is. So which tech module are we supposed to get? With confusion. I thought you knew. What? No. All I heard Varana say was pick up a module. Okay. Uh Welcome to Sarana's applications. Can I interest you? Ah, Shepherd. Do I know you? No, but I know you. Who? Even a senile Hanar would remember the human who fought off the Geth. I thought you were dead. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. <laughs> Please, look around the store. It's a pleasure to have you here. <gasps> Whoa, I can take the renegade option? No, it's okay. I think he, he's pretty cool. You know, I he knows who I am. In my line of work. It's a shame so few understand their own equipment. Besides the most obvious point and go nav interfaces anyway. You wouldn't believe how often I hear, why is the ship turning around? We're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, I would. You know, I like your products. Any interest in an endorsement from the human who defeated Saren? I'd be thrilled. But I don't think I could afford to pay you for it. Don't worry about it. What if we just work out a discount? Absolutely. Just speak Let's to go. the console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store in the Citadel. <laughs> that will be splendid. I can edit that and have it working right away. Thank you so much. Yay, discount. Oh, shit. Oh god, these are expensive. Holy shit. Oh, this looks good on on this. I want to dress up my shepherd in really cool armor. Okay, where's that? Wait, okay, hold on. The attack on the human colony of Freedom's Progress has generated a Commander Shepherd and this is my Ah, my favorite customer. What can I get you? A bolus was in here not too oh, long ago. Yes. He bought some environmental system drivers then left without his chip. I didn't notice he'd left until he was already gone. If you see him, tell him I have it here behind the counter. Here it is. Okay. Thanks for your time. I'll be here if you need anything. That was fast. Oh, oh my God! I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. That's a bad spot. I don't like that. I'll also go to it though. Can I can actually explain why it's a bad spot or show and showcase why it's a bad spot? I failed her. Please move along. You forgot your credit shit at Saranus Applications. The clerk's holding it for you. Oh. Well. The Quarian could have stolen it. Oh. I'll close this event report. But I'll be watching you. Get a private residence or I'll run you in for vagrancy. Are you too serious? What? You falsely accused this girl of stealing Push him. from you. All oh. I have to say now is that yeah. she could have stolen it. Now just a minute. And you. She gets harassed and insulted by this guy, and you throw in a threat to arrest her for vagrancy. How about if I run you in for obstruction of justice? You think you're gonna run in a specter? I think both of you should get out of here. Oh, son of a... Hell yeah. I... I wish I could give you something more than words. It's okay, Tali, too. Just join me. Just join me in my suicide mission. It'll be okay. <laughs> We'll make you tally too. Can you take care of yourself from here? I guess. I mean, most nights I eat nutrient paste in a Turian shelter, but I'm surviving. Thanks. That's kind of fucked up. That's actually really fucked up. Okay, here we go. Hirashimasu. Hirashimasu. Yeah, whatever, man. Okay, I observe the stand. The heck? Back on Earth. Dude, I can go for some ramen right now. I should get some ramen tomorrow. After I'm done with work. What can I get you? Mm, the meat isn't fresh out here, but you won't find any better dried seaweed on the station. We have six kinds of beer on tap. Oh, new beer sounds so good right now. We don't have a karaoke machine anymore. You do not want to hear drunk Elcor sing. Irashimasu. Irashimasu. Okay, yeah, sure. First thing. Okay. Okay, okay, sure, okay. <laughs> okay. I, I, it's endearing. I'll say that much. <laughs> Nothing else. I will not say anything about, anything else about that. 
The karaoke machine sounds cool though. Can you imagine? You're just like eating, you can like you just sing karaoke. Um Okay. Wait. Oh, okay. I know now I know what I gotta do. I was like, I gotta do something at the over here, but you ever had ramen? It's a delicacy. Whatever, man. Greetings, Earth Clan. You will find many excellent ships for sale here. Only slightly used, yes. There is something I have to do here. Um, and I have to buy food for um my mess hall. I'm not too sure what it is actually. Maybe it's at Dark Star Lounge because it's not here. Yeah, it's not. I could go for a can of Asahi right now. Actually, sounds really good right now. Like like a really cold one. Okay, I think it's over here. I'm not too sure. I'll buy some fancy foodstuffs for my ship. I don't know. I wonder what it actually does, though. I've always just done it just for the fake sake of doing it. But I've never actually thought about what the um, rewards, the effects are for upgrading your food. You here? Okay. So there's no fish. I can actually tell, tell the two programs. Okay. Where do I buy food? But that was loud. Okay, so I can actually buy f fake fish and give it to the Krogan and tell him that's fish from the Presidium. Or I can tell him the truth. Um, but it's very clear to it's very clear that which uh, 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 which one I'm gonna be doing. So I still gotta find food. Where the fuck do I buy food here? Here maybe? I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Oh, this is where I buy the fish and give it to him. Whatever. What do you want? I talked to one of the Presidium groundskeepers. He said there aren't any fish in the lakes. What? what? I told you. Why have all that water if you're not going to store something to eat in it? I don't understand aliens at all. Thanks for telling me. It's all he's talked about all damn day. <laughs> it's cute. Oh, it paid me. Wow. Oh, wait. Is this... Oh, it's cafe. Okay, this is where I buy the food. Okay, 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 okay. I don't think I can get a discount here, can I? Nope. Okay. I hear this is the best place for food on Zakara Ward. You heard wrong. This is the best place for food on the whole damn citadel. Ooh. High grade food. It's sushi. It's literally just sushi. The fuck? Huh. I think they may or may not have had one or two weeaboos on the game design team when they made this. There we go. What are these? Ascension novel. 
Written by human author Drew Carpishin. The popular military histor historical novel Ascension focuses on several lives warped or destroyed by the human survivalist cult Cerberus. Ooh. Well, this one. Revelaton. Revelaton is a popular military historical novel by human writer Drew Carpishin. It dramatizes the human conflicts and political expansion following the 20... 2148 discovery of the protein master relay on Pluto and the beginning of human galactic exploration. So one is pro human, the other is not pro human? Is that what it is? Uh, whatever, I don't know what those are for. Okay. And I'm out of here. See ya. Would never want to be ya. That's good. I love the Normandy. I should look up um the the scale figure of it, the scale model of it. Did she come out of a plastic? What? Did she come out of a new plastic model for um? For, for this stuff. Thank you again. Samesh Patita. Patia. Oh, it's the one I retrieved the dead body for. Mr. Udina offered to pass on a message for me. I wish to again express my thanks for your assistance in retrieving my wife's body. Oh. While nothing can ever banish the pain of losing Nirali, being able to see that her body was treated properly helped me more than you can ever imagine. Than you can imagine. I have opened the restaurant that my wife always wished to start back on Earth. Nerala's picture hangs on the wall, and the Lion's soldiers eat for free. It is the least I can do to honor the courage with which both you and my wife has served humanity. Sincerely, Samesh Bhatia. Aww, that's really nice. Title, you're not dead. Yeah, I'm not dead. From Emily Wong, you're alive? How come you broke whatever cover you've been under for two years but didn't offer an exclusive interview to your favorite reporter? Whenever you come up for everybody to talk, let me know. Okay. Take care of Garrus. Nali or Butler. Oh, it's from C-Sec? <gasps> Wait, what? Garrus has a, has a wife? Sorry? Commander Shepard, my husband has was one of the men... Oh, one of the men serving on Garrus' team. Okay. I won't finish reading. That's fine. Okay. Anybody want to talk to me? All on the surface. What? It'll be a challenge. Get oh, Kasumi? Whatever. How may I help? Is there anything? Nothing. I anything else can okay. be all. I'll be here if you need anything. Um, where is I? Uh, check for upgrades. I just set my weapons in my armor. Did I buy a new weapon? Oh yeah, I did. I bought the incisor. It's like a burst, um, burst fire sniper rifle. So that's cool. I'll try that out. The incisor is one of new wave military and police sniper rifles designed to overload active defenses such as shields. Firing three, rows, uh, three shots with each pull of the trigger. The incisor burst is so fast that all three rounds will be in the target by the time the barrel has moved a millimeter, increasing the stopping power without sacrificing accuracy. As an added benefit, the noise of the burst is comparable to a single rifle shot in duration, making it no easier to locate the sniper by sound. Cool. Yo, I read that without stuttering. Wow. I'm evolving, guys. My reading skill, leveling up. Let's go check on the chef. And tell him that we gave, we got him the the, the provisions, the foodstuffs, the good foodstuffs. Commander, those provisions you provided were perfect. I owe you. I've already thrown together some of my calamari gumbo. Here, try a bite. Oh, he doesn't smile. It's sad. The original has him smiling like a fucking cock face. I love it. Ah, there we go. Truth told, it's based on an Asari recipe. Seems a little cannibalistic to me with their tentacle heads and all, but they ain't no good grub. Anyway, <laughs> thanks again. You really came through. That's cool. I could go for some food. I ate dinner, but I feel like eating something else now. God, I'm gonna... <laughs> so hungry. Okay. Yeah, I got more ships from a collection. Ooh. That's the SR1. 
Given the markings. No, that's a shark too. The heck? Yeah, Cerberus colors in that. I thought it was supposed to be. Oh, there you go. SR2 and SR. Ooh! That's the size difference? We're actually flying a bigger ship now? Cool. Okay. Yo, look at that. That's sick. What's the other one? Headshot damage. Uh, I'll, I'll take. I'll leave that. Power damage by 3%. Health by 5%. Okay. Health by 3%. Spare ammo capacity by 10%. Okay. What about this one? Shield strength by 3%. Health by 10%. Shield strength. I guess I didn't actually change out my armor. This is kind of sad. <laughs> Shield strength by 5%. Maybe this one. Or maybe this one. What's this one? Power damage for 5%. And this one's weapon damage. No, headshot damage. Okay. I'm gonna end. I'm gonna stop the music. Jesus Christ. No, stop the music. It's really loud. Holy shit. Does that actually reflect my real time? Oh, it doesn't. Okay. Okay. So. I think I'll call it here for this stream. I have to get prepared for a long day tomorrow. But it's good. It's been a good stream. It's been a good day. Um, yeah. We recruited um, Garrus, a.k.a. Archangel. We did a few side quests. We bought a bunch of armor pieces, a new weapon, weapon that I'll try out next stream for sure. And just generally had good fun, good fun rooting, tooting, and recruiting the boys. We're getting the boys together. Is that fun? Okay, hold on. There we go. Okay, yay! Let me set this up. I'm gonna I'm gonna look for somebody right now. I don't have anybody, I think. I do. Maybe. Is he sleeping? Yes, he is actually sleeping. Okay. Alright. I don't think I have anybody to raid. Nori's drawn art. Or maybe I'll read him. I don't know. Wait, okay, no. Try to find somebody new to raid. Okay, okay. Uh I'll raid I'll raid um I'll raid somebody that's playing Mass Effect. I'll raid a VTuber playing Mass Effect, so we keep the we keep the same vibe space oh dude this is really cool it's a really cool like furry uh avatar they're calling an avatar that's cool it's really expressive holy shit Another one. oh this is mass effect 3 okay i'm not gonna i'm not gonna show that one All right, I found the perfect one to rate. So let's rate this person. Uh, Kite five twelve. Yeah, I have those actually really cool. Oh yeah. So yeah, thank you so much for tuning in, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It means the world to me every time. Um, I'm gonna close out now, and I'm gonna go wash up a little bit, prepare to bed, prepare to sleep, sleep peace, sleep peace. 
and yeah prepare for a long day tomorrow um today tomorrow is going to be a big day um my my japanese language will be tested to its limits tomorrow just gonna leave it at that um just to test a new vr sensor out as well um but yeah stay hydrated keep on keeping on and i'll see y'all next time um next stream will be oh next stream's the vr stream so next stream will be on saturday jst um 11 a.m jst uh i'll be showing off virtual market and vr chat so um hope y'all be there to catch it it'll be really great we'll go shopping window shopping and vr it'll be so cool come on come on down okay all right the timer's gonna oh wait okay okay it's setting up the rate oh no go right now okay thank you so much guys it means the world to me every time you guys tune in thank you thank you big love big love bye take care